Hello, you wonderful beans out there, and welcome back to the stream. I am Raw Zim, and we are doing some Pacific Drive. I've heard this game is really good, and it might be right up my alley, so we're t checking it out today. Ooh, okay. Also, I am Paint the African Wild Dog right. currently. What's the game? Pacific Fire. Drive. Oh, hey, I played that. Let's see this. I, oh, no spoilers. Wasn't <laughs> it a? Isn't it a horror game? And we're starting off with Rex getting TF'd. <laughs> yeah. Air element. That's all things should be. Again, Shadow Wolf. All right, let's see. Uh, let's go. I'm gonna go ahead. Yeah, and... I've gotten a little bit of the ways into the game. Um, if you plan on making it a staple of your channel, I'll probably have to uh, dip at a certain point because I don't want to spoil it for myself. That's not fair. Those kind of games you got to go in blind if you're gonna play it. Mm -hmm. Completely fair. Uh, what did I get changed to? I didn't hear. It. Air. Oh, air. Nice. Yeah. You're a ghost now. You're a ghost, laddie. All right, explore Pacific Drive, self-guided tour. Interesting. Ho Rainforest, Hurricane Ridge, Kalalock and Ruby Beach, Lake Crescent. S and F Ooh. hauling, move once, stay forever. Well, this is interesting. Huh. Um, I'm not actually certain where I'm supposed to go for. I'm guessing one of these. Remember in Pacific, else, in Pacific Drive, the game saves when you load into a new level. You can save during a trip by leaving the current level, triggering a save. Manual save is available in the pause menu from the garage. You can also abandon your trip from the pause menu to return to the garage, triggering penalties and a save. There are options in the settings to modify these penalties. Okay. Would you like to customize your settings before you start? No, I'm just going to start. Ow! Oh, it logged me out, that's why. Okay, try again. What logged you out of where? Uh, Discord reactive images. Oh. What is it? That's why In I 1947, it. the Olympic Peninsula became the staging ground for a promising new technology. As rumors of its utopian creation spread, so did stories about overnight evacuations, unsolved disappearances, and unnatural something. In 1955, the government walled off a section of the peninsula to establish the Olympic Exclusion Zone. For 30 years, the zone's borders grew until the government withdrew and sealed every access point. Huh. What happened inside was never disclosed. I think this is a horror game. Yeah, they're not even hiding it. <laughs> Alright, take it back, Shadow Wolf. I guess that wasn't too bad of a spoiler. Yeah. Just don't say the monster, or whatever it is. There's something wrong with this place. There has to be something wrong with this place. <laughs> I just wonder mm. how it's gonna be. Oh so no, it's happen. on the PS5. Wait, deliver, unload, clean. Okay, is that little dinosaur on there? The Olympic Peninsula, 1998. South of the barrier wall. The music's interesting. Mm hmm. That's yeah. Okay. okay, so gas is. Okay, so forward, back. Okay, typical stop. I can turn on my lights with that. I can turn on my wipers with that. They really just toss me right in here and say, go for it, I guess. Ow! Hi, Izo! <laughs> I'm so tempted to listen to the game. Oh, but I don't hear audio. Oh, no, you got What me. was that? <laughs> I said, I'm so tempted to listen to the audio of the game. Like, listen. I can feed that through Discord if everybody's good with that. 
say if there's more music like that. <laughs> er, go for it. Go for it. Um, All right. I ha I'm not against it. Thank yeah. you, Izo. I definitely love the new paint model a lot. So the tags that are stating the game is is survival, sci-fi, action, exploration, and story rich, according to the Steam. Okay. And I suppose I could also do this. So you guys can watch live. Uh, okay. Down a bit the of the cut. The... There we go. Sweet. I'm happy with Delete. this. No, don't delete the camera. You need those for for scene. Oh, you know what we haven't done tonight? What? I haven't gone on a tangent about something in a while. Oh. Oh, you did. Did I miss that, it? I nah, missed it. The primary, secondary, tertiary source, that was more of like a bite size. Oh. oh. We're going further into it now. <laughs> we can see ourselves talking real time now. Perfect. Huh. Okay, yeah. I'll, I'm gonna let you enjoy this opening sequence. The opening sequence actually is pretty cool. And okay. after, we talk. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> I like the vibes of this already. It's a Same good here. game. Like, I, I actually would recommend it. That reminds me of playing Death Stranding. Just chilling and driving. All I'm getting, though, is that the singer really wants to date me. Oh, I guess that's uh, sealed off. Okay. We won't turn. Just continue driving, I guess. Yep. Won't well, stop me. Did anybody drive on a road like this before? A lot of mountains, trees. Oh, um, I've yeah. done it quite a lot. I live in mountain country. This is the norm. Yeah. yeah. We don't have mountain country where I'm at for a while. I, I kind of like seeing stuff like this. Last mountainy place I drove was Puerto Rico. Oh. I used to, oh. when I lived in Utah, it was all mountains. Oh, yeah? Oh, I can toggle wipers with that. Cool. Um, heading over to New Mexico for Philmont, we had to go through the mountain country in Texas. So it was kind of nice. I always find driving nice, mainly when I'm not the driver. I like to like, look outside and see everything, but I rarely get to do that. The only downside to driving on the mount on the mountains or anywhere mountain wise is the brakes. You have to replace that. That is on the a very uh, restricted area, authorized personnel only. Okay. Yeah, it looks like the wall. From very lethal. large wall. <laughs> lethal company wall. It does actually. Yeah. What do you mean you're worried about not being authorized? Come on, you're definitely authorized. You're paid. True. I'm one of the recallers. I'm allowed to go where paint. I want. Yeah. Is there, wait, is there a paint wait, I don't you, know you, you are a recaller? Oh, God. And just when I thought I couldn't get rid of telemarketers. No, not that recaller. Focus, focus. <laughs> That's a funny one. <laughs> you get a little ring-a-ding and it's just paint just going, Hello, I am going to talk to you about a survey. You want to oh, play no. fetch? <laughs> it just calls you up, asks you to play fetch. <laughs> uh, you got the wrong voice there. That's Asher's voice. Oh yeah, you're right. You I still haven't heard. I still haven't heard the voice actually. I, the last time I watched, oh, you could—he wasn't speaking. You were only doing. He like, still has stuff. not spoken. Okay. Just pick up the phone. You get the mental image of you playing fetch. <laughs> Music. Yeah. Again, kind of stuff that I'd like to find for driving and stuff like this. Ever since Death Stranding, they had some good tracks on there. This kind of reminds me of that. Oh, oh, headlights. Headlights. Okay. Is that the walking simulator that everyone really made? No, it was the one that was kind of mixed. Like a lot. Of, yeah, you did have a lot of hate from it, but it was really good. It was. Uh, it was like truck simulator on foot with upgrades as you went that made it easier and better with Metal Gear all over the place. Uh, 
That was nice. It was basically like point A, point B. You're trying not to break your cargo. You're helping people. The storyline around it's pretty, pretty interesting. I liked it. It's a game you got to get into. It's like like I, how like. Hold on. Warning. High R levels facility. Extreme caution advised. Uh. Further in. What does that say? I think it's further it. inquiries directed to Sade C to B. Huh. That's uh, sketchy. Oh no, too bad we can't read. <laughs> I mean, we all can. It's just, we couldn't see it. We couldn't translate that well enough. Oh. The music is gone. Oh no! That's a bummer. Oh no. Wait. I don't like that audio. Hold up. The cop. I would not stop moving. What is that? I don't like the radio. That's Silent Hill radio. That is terrifying. Haha, <laughs> I would turn around. I definitely would be stopping the car. <laughs> Oh, Gate C two B. So that is further inquiries to Gate C two B. I don't think that was Gate. That was like a J. No, it was Gate. Ah. Uh. uh, launch and construction facility ahead. Periodic volume warning: eighty plus decibels next fifteen miles. Oh. Uh, okay. oh no. Uh -oh. Hopefully you stay in your car the whole time this game's going. <laughs> oh no. Okay, yeah, you get the to stay in your car good. just uh, isn't working anymore. I missed the um, radio. Good time. I'll go ahead now you shall start singing. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Clap, clap. Take me home. <laughs> Country roads Ooh. to the place I belong. I belong. West Virginia, Virginia, Mountain Mama, take me home. Ooh. Yeah, we're like the furthest away from West Virginia we could possibly be. We're in like Oregon. That's normal. Sure. Right. You know what? Sure. It's just so rocks. You've never seen open sewage? I just messing with the ground, earth type stuff. <laughs> Except your error. Crap. Uh, that's not me. That's not me who's doing that. <laughs> you error? Error? Paint? Did you learn how to mess with the rocks? Not like this. Error. Magna doesn't have the capabilities of doing this, neither does Manuelo, so this isn't me. Manuelo, your new, like, Hold up. exotic... What the hell is that? The more surprised you're stopping the car, I would be driving so fast through this. <laughs> Fair point! I just swear I keep um, hearing something growling at me. Also, yeah. I'm, I'm just a wolf. I don't have any. Whoa. The, the... No, no, no. You're Shadow Wolf. You have the ability of shadows. Come on. No, Shadow is my name. Oh, no. My car's dead. Oh, no. Wait, no, I don't know. Oh. Oh, God. No. Whoa. No. No. <laughs> Traveling. <Black hole. laughs> to a new dimension. Jesus. Yeah, no. And I that's why we don't look. stop in Detroit. You get mugged. <laughs> <laughs> you wow. and your car get stolen. Jesus. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Oh, time to go walkies. <laughs> Hello, Manuelo. Man. Fly with me, Gochica. Oh. Uh, why is it I'm Olympic? Sorry. Is that an inside out reference? I have yes. no idea. No, he they answered my question. It was because I was just like, I watch a lot of Disney movies. You better hurry because you're dying. Yeah, I'm putting on my koozie again. 
I think they ripped my car apart. I think they <laughs> did too. Amusingly enough, they did rip you apart, so I guess you, I guess you were a non-critical part of the vehicle. They got the parts I wanted, I guess. Oh no, not the engine. Oh god, this is terrifying. Hey, my willow! Paint my willow! What? <laughs> what? Hmm? Manuelo is a sloth. No, they just had like a Mexican hat. <laughs> oh. Uh, this looks uh safer than what looked like that was uh, radioactive out there. Mhm. Mm That's terrifying. You're gonna be fine, Pay. They repoed my car. <laughs> <laughs> More than this Hello, Balasar. Yeah. We're getting really good about that nowadays. Oh, I can kick! Ha ha! You can kick? Oh no, he's a threat. Oh, Come on. oh wait! Oh, there's somebody here. Wait, you just kicked. Hey, a shush! There's, you know, audio, uh, that there's a story going on here. Yeah, you watch the stream, right? Great, my apologies, I forgot about that. Uh, install summer tire, I guess. <laughs> oh, you get to make a new car! Wait, are you done? That's all you needed to do? Oh, Apparently! Nice. I bet you had to do a whole fetch quest to get this thing going. I'll go with this. You'll oh, yeah, draw a so Magna in a Sailor Moon outfit instead? Alright, well, let's go run right. Stream Raiders real quick. Um, Arky -darky. Apparently, this does have uh, some voice acting and stuff, so please be yeah, careful of it's that. Actually got a, it actually got a, it has a pretty decent amount. Oh. I actually think I'm going to go ahead and head out. Okay. okay. Good night. Have a good night. Night. It's just literally because work and everything, but I'll catch y'all later. See ya, have a good rest. Have good work, have good night. <laughs> well, tomorrow's Monday, ugh. Uh, Raijin? I would definitely, I would definitely like to be in a Sailor Moon outfit. Although, I don't know how... Oh yeah, I have the elements! That means I could be <laughs> each Sailor Moon with every... <laughs> Every iteration of Rex. Oh, have no. Wind, have fire. Yeah, I have the fire, I have wind, Venus, Mars. Uh, the fire one's my favorite, though. You just have a the fire of Sailor universe. Moon. The, of the Sailor Moon. You just hey, have to toss that out into the universe. Huh? Pluck for me. Buck, but why? But why? But why? But why though? Because I like <laughs> it when you do that. I command pure chaos! Wait, look Ryan Theolf oh. has turned Rex Strider into a totodile. No. Oh, like I Pokemon see why Brian minutes. actually left. So he could do that without uh, repercussions. <laughs> totodile. Totodile. Dow, dow, dow. Totodile. Ah, place your troops, everybody. Dial. Tora, tora. All right, let's turn this key. Throw it down. See, there's more. Story. Oh wow, I'm surprised this thing actually uh, started. Hey. Oh. oh. Yes, it's back. It's back. This is Tobias Ballo and Francis Cook, located in Mid-South Dakota. My turn to save the day. Ryan Fields wants everyone I'm in chat to know. Picking up your distress signal. Want to say that I love hanging out with you all. Catch you all tomorrow. <laughs> Even from beyond, he's able to endure the void. I know you didn't mean to, that's kind of funny. You're still a Toto Dial, Rex. Toto Toto Dial, Toto Dial, Dial. Brian, you are precious. Even when he's not in voice, he's still a traitor. Dial! He's a traitor to the zone. It looks like you're somewhere around Sector E. 
Hey, Francis, come here. Yes, it's urgent. Leave that interferometer alone for a second. <laughs> Something is out there. Hey, we got a live Don't one. Me. Hey, do you copy? Hello? Hello? Is this thing working? They, they, they don't have a transmitter. We won't hear a thing back. Huh. But if they're stranded, could they, I mean, they're what? from outside? They're a breacher? Hey, hey, how did oh. you get through the barrier wall? No one's gotten into the zone in ages and lived to tell about it. And if we don't get them to safety, this one won't either. That's a good point. Hey, hey you're in serious danger. The instability's closing in, and it's gonna scramble you quicker than beef in a blender. Your closest Ooh. shelter is a few miles east. Get there however you can, and be quick about it. Okay. Oh. Well, this got escalated. Oh, hey, we got music. I mean, I just, I just, I'm just thinking out loud. <laughs> about what? Oh, Ryan, stop it! Oh yeah. I hope I'm going east. Oh, I've got a little compass right here. Okay, I am going right east. It, there, there's only realistically one path to take. Yeah. Yeah. Just imagine fair. Paint, paint driving a car now. Let's go! Yeah. Wind element in the car window poking my head out. The wind's going him. Yeah. Last just standing off to the side like. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why am I in this car? <laughs> Why am I here? This would be so, a place they'd go to. What's that? We, we, we have Shadow here. Does that mean, Rex, that you and I are Chance and Sassy? Oh, Chance and Sassy? Yeah, Chance and Sassy. Oh, you are not good Homeward Bound right now. Is that for Homeward Bound? Yes. yes. Oh my god, that's so nostalgic. Uh, we're, we're, we're going on a trip. Um, <laughs> Wait, what's going on? I don't know. Apparently I need to uh, siphon fuel, though. I guess I ran out of gas. Oh, shit. No, it's right there. Yeah, if you haven't seen Homeward Bound... It's oh, I'm missing speed. a door! Oh, that makes sense. That's where Lost... Isn't that where Lo La Last was? Oh, no! <laughs> That's when Lex was sitting. Well, <laughs> I'm sure they catch up. But no, uh, it's a really cute, cute movie about a bunch of pets trying to get back home through much of this kind of area. Actually, check it out sometime. Homeward Bound. It's a sequel too. I didn't go rewatch. Dogs and a cat. Yeah. But in this case, it's three dogs. No, two dogs and a wolf. I can't believe this. <laughs> I'm hearing things. No, there, there's two dogs and a puppy. No. See ya. See ya, Raijin. Okay, filling up my tank from stolen gas. Is it stolen, really? <laughs> Who'd you steal it from? Oh, Get geez. the fuck out of there! Run okay, okay. Get in! Get in! Go! You're gonna Please. be scrambled! Oh no! Run! Arr! Arr! Oh god! The green! The green! The green definitely does not seem to be good! Yeah, I think it's trying to Hold up. you. Hold up, story. There it is again, that blip on the spectrometer. I've seen that waveform before, but where? Oh, kidding. What could it be? A remnant? That can't be. There hasn't been one in decades. Look at that spectral fingerprint and tell me that doesn't match the remnants exactly. No, no, no. What, what, what we should be looking at is how fast this breacher seems to be moving. Huh. You know, if I didn't know better, I'd say they're going about the speed of a... No way. No way to not tell me. They found a remnant and it's a car this time? Holy cripes! No one's had working wheels in here for ages. Boy, I'd kill to know how a combustion engine's still chugging away out there. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Okay. First, the breacher needs to get to safety. Then we can look into whether that car is a remnant or not. It 
my heart of hearts, I already know. They're back, baby. Huh. Okay, apparently this car is some sort of supernatural entity. Yeah, that works. You have an, you're in an SCP. An SCP just... Toyota. Toyota oh, SCP no, Tundra. Tahoe. Oh, the oh. the <laughs> props are rock. Hold on. See the or the instability turns this newbie inside out. What's to stop her from killing them the minute they step foot onto her property? Maybe she'll be more reasonable than the last time we heard from her. Yeah, I'm not convinced either. But hey, it, it's not every day that decades old legends reappear. Who are you know? That's exactly why she can't be involved. We can't trust her with something this important. I know, I know. But you know we've got no reach in the outer zone. Until the preacher can get around on their own, up is all we've got. Don't worry, you live the talking to me. When have you ever not done the talking? Okay, I guess we might get shot the moment we get to wherever we're going. Fun. Also, what? Ethan oh. Henry, <laughs> thank you very much for that follow. So you got your radio back. Yes, Why I did. The people that are... Why do the people on the radio sound like announcers or something? Like, either for a NASCAR or basketball or football or something. Why do they sound Probably. like they're announcers? I don't know, probably because they hired a couple of people who sound good over the radio, specifically because they're going to be talking over the radio. I'm just a guess. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I, I get it, I get it. Wait, Rex, how do you feel about Precure instead? Precure? I don't understand. Elaborate. More context is, per is required. Find a way into the building. Okay. You can always crash the car into the building. That's one way to get the place. Don't listen to the devil on your shoulder. Park I'm the car. A, I'm not a devil. <laughs> I'm just a wolf. The wolf wanted you to crash the car. Don't crash the car. This. Listen, 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 listen. Let's all around shoulder. Listen. You have a battery ram that has a V8 as an engine. It'll work. Yeah, that a horse trash can? <laughs> I have there. no idea. Ooh. Uh. Riding around. What was that? I just said try hitting around. Yeah. Okay. You run pretty fast. Well, yeah, I'm sure. Oh, the store's already open. Cool. Oh, right. We are 100% going to get shot in here. Yeah. Maybe. This place seems Gotta very safe. Flip the breaker switch, apparently. All right. All right. Wait, 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 wait. What did that vending machine say? Rock and <gasps> cola. Yeah. Kind of remind me that's, of Fallout for a second. That's got to <laughs> be a Fallout reference. Yeah. Pick up the backpack from the table. Okay, I guess ah. we're just stealing somebody's backpack. Who's there? Oh. Uh -oh. You've got five seconds to get the hell out before I... Oh, my head. It's an emergency broadcast. Hello, uh, attention. This message is for Dr. Ophelia Turner. We sent a breacher to your garage on um, oh, the official zone business. Now, we have it on very good authority that this person is in possession of a remnant. Which has taken the form of a car, and well, uh, oh. they're off the remnant thing. She's not gonna care. Um, uh, right, like I <laughs> said, super officials own business. Protocol uh, demands that you keep them alive until we can get them to safety. Now, if you do not comply, I will occupy this broadcast channel with a recitation of the entire collection of poems I've personally written. That <laughs> ten years and sixteen <laughs> volumes. And Dang. <laughs> Nail gun to the skull. <laughs> so, another breacher, huh? 
how do you outsiders not understand that Arda didn't build that 300 meter wall out there for fun? Unless you're one of the unfortunates who got zapped through. Wait, I just remembered. I don't give a damn why or how you got here. You're trespassing, and I'd kindly like you to get the hell out of my zone. Oh, God, unfortunately, the barrier wall is as fortified against breaches trying to get in as it is against anyone or anything trying to leave. We have to find you a way out. So you might as well start by fixing up that car. Just don't break anything in my shop with those soft hands of yours. Mm -hmm. Rex, you have apparently been... Oh. What? Oh, you need help? Video well, there's thing? a headset somewhere in the garage. Put it on. The built-in diagnostic will tell you what needs fixing up. Oh, cool. Okay, so... First things first, I think I'm going to bring my car in. Oh. <laughs> oh! One of my wheels disappeared. What the hell happened to my wheel? Like I said, Detroit. Dang. Can't have anything, I swear! <laughs> the world's I have not like, seen... we're taking this. I have not seen Precure Princess. <laughs> Looks pretty fab, though. Alright, let's drive the car in. Connected? Okay. Wait till wow. there's like a safe moment for me to say what I'm about to say. <laughs> like an evolution oh, they of turn the wipers off after turning it off. Yeah, nice. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and my job to tease. Okay, I need a headset. Is it this one? Apparently not. Oh, I still gotta pick up the backpack. Oh, I can't find the backpack. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Can't find this. Put on mechanic's eye. <laughs> oh, hello. Tend to my wounds at the first aid station. Okay. Now I need to fix it. Oh, I already pulled the car in. Oh, no, something's happening to you. You're Put the wheel it. back on. Well, where did the wheel go? Oh, it's outside. Did it fall off all the way over here? There's yes. a target there, it seems. Yeah, I guess it fell off back there. Huh. Maybe the universe. Freak or okay. Open headset OS. Uh, what key is that? That's oh, tab. tab. Yeah, headset OS. Huh? Interesting. Add to your do list the door. Blueprints. Oh, I can craft a crude door apparently. Okay, this game's way more intricate than I thought. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, that's what I thought too. I'm like, oh, there's more things to do than I thought. Gather items from the abandoned car behind the garage for your checklist. Search the abandoned car's trunk. Okay. Oh, we're getting a double raid. Nice. Oh, what's up? Hello there, Ito! Hello, Cat! How was your streams? Rank up. Hold hey, y'all, what's up, homies? Shall not fall. Hello there, Cat. Hello, Noel. Hello there, Average Goat Man. Hello, Red. Sorry, Noel. It is Noel, right? I keep forgetting. Yes, Noel. So sorry. What's up, Goat Man? Hey, Red. Double. Oh, we, God. We, we, got, uh, we, we got a Rex here. He's being a good familiar. Yeah, Curly Elemental Rex. We're uh, we're playing a really neat game where we drive a car in like a parallel dimension with SCPs. Our car is encrypted. It's interesting. But yeah. But Didn't yeah, welcome on in. Uh, you did a session of Stardew Valley, 
saw the good boy and wanted to stop by. Ah, so he didn't want to stop for me. I see. But he How is sweet. a good boy. Well, Pate's the good. Remember, Pate's the good boy too. By the way, have you seen have you seen that model? That's uh, Pate from Recall Is It Lost. And that's also where uh, I am from. The uh, Elemental Rex. It's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. it's all right, Noel. You got a family here on the. You, you got a family here. You got people that care about you. It's him. What? I started on the eggs. I'm okay. making the scrambled eggs. I want scrambled eggs. Now I'm gonna rub it in your face. Okay. I've, I've cracked it in every single. Ah, time. I need a pie <laughs> bar. Got it. See those emotes. Yeah, man. Well, how's Stardew Valley? I was actually looking at people playing because, like, uh, Kira the Raptor's playing it too. I was thinking about poking people here to play it. It's good to see y'all back on there. It wants to be played it. Oh, uh, for what? Stardew Valley. Oh. Yeah, we played that for a while with Death Squad for a bit. Oh, I got a mod list for that one. We modded it too. Everybody's furries. Our... I insisted. Oh, this is duct tape. I thought that was uh, oxygen for a moment, and I'm like. Oh, because um. O2? <laughs> yeah. Ah, it did so as, a as, you can, as you can see, their uh, inventory system is very Russian. Huh. Huh. Wow. Yeah, as in, like, you know, you get so much space and you gotta slot things into the space. Hmm, I kinda like that style from... Resident I'm Evil liking it so far. Definitely the game is not what I expected. Okay, I guess like I gotta it. equip this. Uh, equip. Ah! Pry it open! <laughs> this is my power now. You can press T to transfer all the materials if you wanna do that. Oh. Probably would have been good yeah, to know be... earlier. Yeah, it's something I discovered a little bit in, and I figured you might as well save you the hassle. When you say a little bit in, how far in? Well, I only, I only got to like the first significant point. Like that's about it. Okay, uh, so I gathered that. I'm not, I'm, I can't say more dumpster. because I don't want to spoil. But yeah, I, I don't. Friendly dumpster. I don't think this dumpster is friendly. That was purple. Friendly dumpster? What's what I call him? I eat purple. Huh? He just spat out car parts. That's with the indigestion. Um... What? <laughs> okay. Um, right. Anyways, uh, yeah, welcome in, everybody. Uh, we're trying Pacific Drive for the first time, and, uh, this is a thing so far. A most thing of all time. Yeah. TLDR, they were on a trip or something. They got sent into a... They stopped at, what was it, Detroit? What was it? <laughs> Some, yeah. Somewhere. They stopped at Detroit. Hey, they got their car and themselves. <laughs> pulled away. Hey, Toshime. And, uh, yeah, they're trying to get their car back going. Well, their new car that's currently encrypted. Clearly, what gave it away that, was, that it wasn't a crypt? Ah. Might as well take all the fuel from here. Have yeah. some extra. I'd recommend say I'd recommend saving the rest in your gas can. Oh, okay. You have a gas pump literally right by you. Oh, so I do. Yeah. Okay, what, scrap the, the gather items from the abandoned car, scrap the abandoned car's wheels, panels, and doors. I'm guessing with this thing. You are correct. Have fun? <laughs> Why is this the same? 
What's with that um, space engineer bot when you take the butt, the power saw and you just break a piece off? And you get all the individual pieces. Actually, wait, Zim, have you ever played Space Engineers? Yes, yes, I have. Oh, okay, so you know what I'm talking about. Yes, yes, I do. Nice. Time for me to get the cheese. I'm gonna melt it. Rex! Mm -hmm. I'm on I'm fighting the urge as well. <laughs> I want to get eggs too. Rex, aren't you a chicken? Can't you just generate eggs? Go oh, do he's that. a familiar. Can't oh. familiar generate eggs? Make earth or wind eggs. I don't know what I don't know which I'm going to go for right now. I can't see stream right now. Yeah. Oh, you're yeah, watching the uh, air. Yeah. Why aren't you watching the stream? You know. I mean, I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to hurt myself or make my plate of pancakes fall onto the floor, breaking the plate. You what? You can't watch yeah. the stream and eat at the same time? No, I'm making food, Rex. Wait, you're in the kitchen? Yes. That's why I'm oh. louder. If you've noticed. Yeah. I, oh. Okay. Yeah. I, I I don't really comprehend people eating baking breakfast while what the stream happening. I Wait. didn't know you were doing that. Wait, you never had breakfast for dinner? I never had breakfast while we're doing a stream. <laughs> Anywho, oh. you're vibing. I see you're vibing over there. Let's go. Yes, yes, I am. <laughs> they got some jams in there. <laughs> nice. Oh, yes, yeah, so I need like... to craft a crude door. Craft. We're going to have pry bar, mechanic kit, seal, crew. Oh, nice to it. I guess I'll slap this on here. It's kind of wild they let you customize this thing that more leads like build it like that. I Get the repair putty from the locker? Oh. Good luck. When you don't have the item or the resources to perform extensive repairs, this is the spit and tape solution that will carry you through and fix up the worst of things. Oh, good to know. Oh, fancy. Oh, spare tire. Uh, let's equip that. Oh, the tire has a certain amount of... Oh, Hold no. up. What? what was that noise? Okay, I think we're okay. Uh... Yes? How do I store this? Trunk crafting, trunk storage... Can I, like, attach this somewhere? Um... I feel like this is something that I want to... Uh, okay, we'll just drop that. Uh... No, I don't want those in my hands. Sign quick slot. How do I? Ah, there we go. Boom. Cool. Now this. That. Now three. Repair the car body. Use the repair putty to repair the car. Okay. This needs repaired. Oh! Did you just slap it? I just slapped it on there and it's apparently repairing it. That's a good <laughs> That's one with a repair. This stuff works pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yeah works. Okay. Pancake 
make sure that the bacon is done, the eggs were finished. Oh, definitely want to repair this. My breakfast for dinner is ready. That's nice. Hey, Rex, you caught me a er, I've been like making this food while chatting with Sim not all uh, for the night. So you caught the tail end of it. Okay. Okay, so I guess there's another part that I need to repair. Oh, I still need a rear bumper and a door on the back. What else do we have to repair? A new Tanya! We are building an army. Tanya's 18 just resubscribes for 39 months. Let <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't even see that part off there. <laughs> that caught me off guard. I thought you were just barking and yipping the whole time. Tanya, yeah, thank you so much for that uh, resub. And your 39 months of support. Thank you. Okay, Ooh. what else am I supposed to repair here? For some spotting RGB uh, paint. <laughs> That's cool RGB. Radical. Uh, I guess there. this crude door. I think it helps because of the ah. There we go. <laughs> that looks even cooler. Scan the flat tire. Okay, how? What am I scanning with? Hmm, your eyes. <laughs> and what tire is flat? Oh. For it's highlighting it, okay. Let's see. Oh, my nose. <laughs> Fix ceiling kit. Okay. Repair the flat by crafting and using a ceiling kit, or replace the flat with the spare tire found in the locker. Uh. I'd rather craft this ceiling kit. Yeah, we got the resources for it. This is just a gun! <laughs> it's a clean gun. Hey, shot it, it back. Just pull. And the loose wheel, okay. <laughs> Fix mechanics kit. Alright, I've got that in my pocket here. Put it there. When Four. Down, shoot it. <laughs> it would have been so delayed. There we go. Now watch the, the real time feed. Ah. Zone preparation. Outfit the car. Okay. <laughs> Install the cardboard boxes in the trunk. <laughs> I guess I'm just stealing this lady's boxes. I think she's letting you do this, so... <laughs> Kinda. Of. Oh. Install the craft yeah. mat. Okay. Oh. Install the. <clears throat> There's oh. a little prototype of mine in the garage. The arc device. Hook it up to your car, wherever it'll fit. Oh. Okay. Okay. Yeah, she is just giving you stuff. You finding out you like coffee? <laughs> Ah, right, let's do stream raiders. And I'm gonna pet the Rex. Pet, 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 pet. I'm gonna join in for the room. stream raiders next time. What I find funny is when you were fixing the other tire, all you did was tap it with the. That's all you did. And it was like, oh, they're fixed. Perfect. It was a special kitchen gun. The kitchen gun, there we go. Oh, well, that was you that shot it. That was from Don, yeah. Ah, oh, that's fair, Avalios. Alright. I've got a quest to turn in. Click the ish. Ow. Bye, Tanya. Where 
Right on cute. Oh, the Rygon is asleep. <laughs> I heard, I heard the mwah. <laughs> there, there. Thought I heard it too. I must say, Murp is asleep. That's what they Start all say. The Rygon sleep. The you know, Rex, I don't have to end so early now for us to hang out because you don't do the work thing now. So I can go later on stream. My huh? That's true. You can. <laughs> okay, so I guess I'm not having any passengers. Oh, what the frick! <laughs> this beauty won't just be your oh. guard. It's your north star and the only way back to safety. Heck. You should consider it the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit if you plan on staying alive. That's how okay. important this thing will be to you. Yes, that's okay. my very own invention. I'll tell you more about it if you live long enough to use it. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Okay. Good setup. This has some good dialogue. <laughs> good writing. Let's pick this up. We're good. Uh... Is that story? Ah, that is story. Cool. Store that. Now, what else can we loot from here? Nothing there. Nothing there. That'll let me interact with or steal. Pick up the gear blueprint by the front garage door. Okay. Another blueprint. Oh! Impact hammer, eh? Haha! <laughs> that sounds useful. Yeah. that away. I guess I can't just... Actually, wait. Uh, drop that? Uh, pick this up. Ah! I can fill up this fuel can. Yay! Good. Extra fuel. Ah, put this in here. Do we have snacks? Very no much. snacks yet. Oh. I'm sure we'll find some soon, though. Wow. I feel like getting a rear bumper and stuff would be good for this. Uh, let's use this. What do I need for plastic, duct tape, glass shards? I don't have any of those ingredients. Okay. Uh, anything else I can loot from here? Because I'm sure anything might be useful. Can you solve more things around here? Oh, good idea. <laughs> oh, even running it uh, consumes stuff from it. Okay. Ooh. So I shouldn't do it unless I'm certain that I can uh, do that. Yep. But I do know that there is a computer out here that I could do something with, Ooh, potentially. There's some glass or something out Who's on the left? Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm just checking other stuff. Consumer electronics. 
Woo! Yay, parts. Ooh, radio. Oh. You gonna take off the radio? No more music. This ain't my yep. radio. <laughs> Anything else I can scrap? Friendly dumpster, do you have anything else for me? I would not. I would not attack that dumpster. <laughs> oh, I wasn't going to attack the dumpster. <laughs> I know. Just, just in case you were going to try to scrap something from me, I was like, oh, they might attack you back. Oh, I need to break that with an impact hammer. I see. How do I craft that? I learned how, but... Or I got the blueprint for one. Oh, can I scrap anything off of this? Is that a whistle? Yes, something whistled. There are many things whistling at me. I don't like it. Yeah, I don't think you should go over there. That's not the good kind of whistle. Oh, that's a bird. That's a bird. Yeah, that's a bird. Some of those sound like birds. Then the Kill Bill whistle starts coming in. <laughs> was it just my imagination or was there something moving over there? Like a person. Uh... I hope it was your imagination, because I didn't see it. Wait, what? Do you see something in there? I do. Huh. Okay. Okay, impact hammer. Gas cylinder and gear. Well, I don't have a gas cylinder, but, uh... Hey, let's see if we can get a bunch of other stuff. I've got gears, gear. sir. I can make gears. That's good. I need two of those. Okay. He's got a gas cylinder now. I cannot craft one. Dang. I need more duct tape! <laughs> Crude bumper. Apparently, this entire game runs off of duct tape. Hey, we're all right. set. Take a look at the projector against the wall. The projector? <laughs> uh. Oh, the same. This is the zone. Within these borders, all matter has lost the ability to hold a constant physical state. What that means is the shape, size, and makeup of just about everything constantly changes. A mile of grass can turn into 10 miles of swamp in the blink of an eye, and it does, constantly. It's caused by something we call instability. We're completely surrounded by it, and once you've watched it chew through entire mountain ranges, you'll understand that you don't want to get anywhere near it. We can only survive in here within pockets of stability. That's what you're standing in now. And that's what you're seeing mapped on the route planner. If we're going to find you a way out of the zone, you'll need to build a new antenna. Until then, you won't be able to detect stabilized routes beyond your immediate area. So, you've got to go hunting for parts, and that means taking a drive. Go on, pick a route. The Octavice in your car will then show you where you need to go. Okay. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Interesting game. Off you go. Make a left out of the garage and follow the access road. Okay. Man, nothing what I expected at all, but I'm mad. I was not expecting any of this either, but I'm all for it. Ooh. Ooh, a paint shelf. <laughs> Decal the shuttle radium driver. Ooh, that sounds radical. How do you get your 
I have no idea. Should all else fail, honk the horn. Okay. <laughs> the car has an emergency protocol that will save your life, but very little else. Good to know. Oh, so you'll lose all your stuff. Taking everything with you is not a great idea. So, along each route, you'll find different resources and face strange hazards, so make sure to choose your path carefully. Uh, choose between revisiting known junctions to gather more resources, charging new routes deeper into the zone, or taking investigative drives to uncover the story behind why you're here. Excuse me. Come back. Oh, there's a lot of, uh... Journal Fragment, Date Unknown for Consumer Electronics. Everyone's checked out of town. At this point, I'm the last person left. I'll be gone by tomorrow, too. It's hard to believe this was once a community. Sure, we didn't have that much to show for it. Not much to offer visitors, no great sites or famous landmarks. But a few of us lived out here, and we were happy with our lot. And then it seems the government had other plans for us. You no longer live here, they said. Here's your compensa compensation payment. Now get out. Their weird secret experimentation zone keeps growing. They own this land now, this town, and soon we'll never be able to come back. They barely gave us enough to cover the cost of moving. Now it's time to work out what to leave behind. Okay. Our route? Arc device. Riding shotgun with you is perhaps the most ramshackle and yet remarkable example of technology that you've ever seen. It can monitor the zone, ingest anchor energy, and casually teleport the entire car and all its contents a short distance. It may be a work of genius, it may be extremely illegal stolen technology, or it may very well be both. Illegal? Mindful oh, no. battery. Every curious crafter's favorite tongue tickler. This will power most small devices found in the home, as well as many portable ones. I don't necessarily want to read Arnold Dash, but I kind of want to read it eventually anyway, so might as well read it now when there's not quite as much. Uh, chemicals, the sort of domestic substances that are only nominally inert. Just waiting for a household chemist with a dangerously narrow amount of knowledge to truly bring them to life. Copper wire. Several coils of one of the most conductive materials in existence. This is an essential core component in both electronics and heating. Assorted electronic components. Each is waiting patiently to be soldered to another and once again restored to life. Lurk Cobalt! Thank you very much for that follow! Welcome! Glass shards. A perfectly usable chunk of this brittle but hard-wearing substance. Glass has a dozen potential applications from windows to optics. Plastic, one of the most useful and ubiquitous substances ever created. This handful of polymers has a thousand different applications and will likely outlive us all. Rubber. Loose pieces of synthetic rubber taken from seals, tires, rings, and belts. Much of this could be recut and repurposed. Scrap metal. 
an assortment of irregular and damaged sections of steel, all of which could be easily recycled and reused. Duct tape. The adhesive properties of this industrial strength product are not to be underestimated. It both attaches items and removes skin with terrifying tenacity. Road flare. Cheap, equipable power light source. Useful in a pinch, this powerful potassium based incendiary burns bright and burns brief, even in the wettest of conditions. Door. It's just a door. Somehow this poorly sealed door can barely defeat a draft, yet it's still sturdy enough to deter just about any trespasser. Pet, pet, pet. No. Hello there. Hello. Holy crap, there is so much in here. Yeah, pretty impressive. <laughs> when the Statuses! Flat! You blew it! Truly the most anomalous of conditions that can befall a wheel. A gaping hole in the precious, precious rubber. Fortunately, remarkable advances in tire patching technology mean this can be repaired in no time at all. Alternatively, a spare tire does wonders for continued mobility. And you did pack one, right? Yes. Yes, I did. Ha ha. Locked. Heavy duty. There has to be some way to open this. This is locked, though that always doesn't mean... Though that always doesn't mean you'll need a key. Many simple locks can be forced with small tools, though tougher ones will require heavier equipment. Keypads, of course, will require a code or a zap. Breaking those won't get you anywhere. Loose wheel. It's wobbling. Of all the components you have on your car, this is certainly one that you don't want to work itself free. It's time to break out a mechanics pit and a mechanics kit and make repairs. Essential. Sometimes the dumpster knows best. The friendly dumpster wouldn't be your best pal in all the zone if it wasn't handing out things that it thinks you really, really need. Things you definitely, certainly should keep in order to safely make it through the next leg of your journey. Best pal status to be TBC. I don't know what that stands for. To be continued? To be continued. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would make... That would make the most sense to be continued. Like, to be determined. EBD. Gonna be here for a while. Oh my god, there's even stuff for the decals. What the heck, game? Okay, I'm done with that. Let's drive. <laughs> oh, we can drive. Um... I'm sorry, Noel. I'm a cow. I go moo. I'm a mill tank. Okay. I guess we'll turn the key. Put us into drive. And away we go. Vroom, vroom, mother fluffer. <laughs> Hello there, everyone. Hope things have been going well. Hello! Jim was reading a lot from the encyclopedia. I see. Yes, I was. I had, I had, I had trouble with the internet. That's why I left all of a sudden. Things uh -oh. are fine now, thank we. Why did everything just oh. go black? Oh no. Mm. I guess I'm in a. Okay. Oh, you're in the map. Or choosing your location, I guess. I don't know. Why do things keep changing colors? Because why not? Okay, newbie. I'll keep oh, it simple. Story. Don't want to overwhelm that little brain of yours. You'll need a few things to rebuild the antenna at the garage. First on the list is plasma. 
The woods are littered with plasma generators. Look for a research trailer or a spark tower. That's those antenna things zapping you when you get too close. Both are always accompanied by plasma generators. The tracks are jumping on their own now. The rain is asking if I know how much okay. it hurts. Oh, someone here right now. No. Your headset has a built-in scanner. Use it on the plasma generator, and it'll figure out the tools you need. Wow, for somebody that was uh, supposedly going to try and kill me, uh, she's actually kind of friendly. Mm -hmm. My aching soul is terrible. Okay. My aching soul is terrible. What was that? Rex, are you about to fall asleep? What? No. Oh, it looks that? like it's ripe for the picking. Can't get at it with your hands, though. An impact hammer will do the trick. Impact hammer. Rex, do you need to reevaluate? That's an old meme. <laughs> Find those materials by any means necessary. No one's coming back ever again, so go on and take what you need. Transports, homes, outposts, facilities, they've all been abandoned since the zone was decommissioned in 87. Most of those structures won't even be there the next time the instability scrambles the area. So loot to your heart's content. Just loot away. Cool. Wait, what's because of the bite of 87? Maybe. I don't know. Alright, we need one of these. Oh, right. Let's just go and scan it. Look at you! Out of the zone all on your own! They grow so okay. fast, don't they? And I'll be back at the helm! Been a long time, old gal. Didn't think we'd, uh, talk again after that whole Sasquatch incident. Yes, I was hoping to go another decade without hearing your voice again. What did you finally talk Francis to death? Hello to you too, Oppy. And no, I'm still here. I can only imagine what it looks like for you, Rex. What? What <laughs> looks like for him? I'm sorry, I needed the mute. <gasps> oh no! My scrapper uh, broke. Oh no. Um. I hope I've got the stuff to make a new one. So okay, I do. Stuff. <laughs> so, so stuff breaks like in Minecraft after a certain point. That's something. I mean, to be Part fair, most of it's kind of just uh, slapped together. Ah. I guess that makes sense. It was hey, Rex, Rex came down to lay down with me. I'm going to get out of the call and talk with him for a little bit. Okay. Uh, when he gets Good up, night. I'll be back. Night night. What the hell just screamed? I don't like Sorry. that. Must... Sorry, it might have been me. I was practicing my howling. Really a work in progress. If you heard me scream instead of howl, my bad. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, we'll put this in here. Hey, uh, uh, 
a driver. I bet you're dying to hear all about the remnants by now. How can you not? I'm a little busy trying to keep them alive. I'll keep to the basics, I promise. They deserve to know what they're getting into. Fine. I'm giving you 60 seconds. That is not nearly enough time to get... 55 seconds and counting. Okay, okay, okay. The remnants, in short, they're old objects that do all sorts of weird things. They bind themselves to people, and, and you're the latest victim. You and the car are inseparable now, so, so get acquainted. Once the remnant is bound to someone, they become gradually more obsessed with it. It takes over the victim's mind, until they go crazy and run off into the zone with it. No one has ever been able to resist its siren call. That fixation is probably worming its way into your brain as we speak. Oh! This is the first time we've ever got our hands on one. But we know all about the past remnants, and oh gosh, this one time it materialized as an old copper kettle, and the tea that came out of that thing, it was... And now I'm splitting the transmissions going to your receiver. Anything critical to your immediate needs will broadcast directly and immediately to your radio and headset. Anything not mission critical will be on a low priority frequency. Those transmissions will be recorded and indexed for you to listen to at your leisure. And by low priority, I mean just about everything that comes out of Tobias's mouth. Fair enough. Nice tea. Understandable. It, that will work against people that are like super chatty. Just record this and send it to the person so they can listen to it later. Ooh, hazmat cabinet. Ooh. Pressurized cartridges. Chemicals. Gas cylinder. Ooh, gas cylinder. I can make one of those impact hammers now. Ah, nice. Can I make a yeah, flashlight one. yet? Because I can barely see Jack Diddley squat. Okay. So now I can craft an impact hammer. Cool. Oh! This is not what I was expecting when it said impact hammer. Oh. <laughs> Wait. I think this is another gun. Oh. Ah. A battering, a battering ram. <laughs> That's interesting, I believe. That's convenient. I like that design. Me too. Uh, no, I want to take everything. Um... Ooh, trash can. Maybe you'll find the raccoon. You have one of what on your wish list? Oh, this is a bathroom. Hey, what's talking about the game? Show you the game. Okay, this one is not a bathroom, but there's nothing in there to loot. Oh, that flares out. She got the crack in the other one. Okay, plasma generator. I recommended a tool impact hammer. Okay. That does not 
seem like the smartest decision here, but I suppose they know best. <laughs> At least the glass shrunk to nothing. Indeed. Oh, I didn't want one to put that in there. Give me that back. Uh, back, that takes a day cool. Ugh. Welcome back, Rex. Never oh, sorry. Oh, damn, Nick. Nickel, are you, are you okay? Feeling sick? No, I opened the closet and there's a box that had a bunch of, like, you know, dust and, you know, stuff in it, so it's oh. been kind of going all over the place. Uh, allergies. Oh. It's yeah. nipples. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see how this works. It's like a puzzle. You gotta make her fit so you can put it in, I'm guessing. Well, each of these little boxes are a different container, apparently. Or like a different pocket over here. Kinda neat. But it's time for Stream Raiders, so let's go run that. Hmm. Rex is a good boy, 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 Rex is a good boy. Pet, pet, pet. <laughs> I love the noises that Briggs begins making when he's like that. It's his tail pumping. Yeah. I thought I this was. He is such a good boy. <laughs> is somebody getting tired? Um. Hmm? No, I'm just. I get it. Oh, I'm so congested. Oh, hey, you place troops. To be fair, being congested can also make you feel tired. Bullseye Bronco! Thank you very much for that follow! Welcome! I mean, at least it does to <laughs> Does to you? Yeah. When it, whenever I get congested, I begin feeling tired. Hmm. Alright. Let's place your troops, everybody! And back to the game. God, Mirai does such a good job on these borders. Yeah. Like, she does. Seriously, you can barely tell that the border isn't part of the game. Honestly, yeah. This theme's really good. <laughs> um, I got one guy from the... I got one guy from the stream because the screen share, everything's cut to a certain degree. Hmm. What do you mean everything's cut? Give me a minute, I'll screenshot the Twitch screen on my iPad and I'll screenshot the Discord screenshot so you can see what I'm talking about. Oh, I can build a crude door now. Nice. Ooh. There. Now we've got an actual door on the back of our car. I wonder how you oh. do the cosmetic part though. This way. Oh, Switch. that's actually really good setup for that uh, audio. Mm. When I close it, the okay. uh, music is quieter. It's actually that's really well done. Yeah. Ah, more stuff to this. Um. Oh, that's ominous. Uh, Very. Maybe it's time to go back to the car? Yeah, it might be time to go pretty soon. You know, just keep that in mind. Um, keep looting, I guess. I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> Rip spare tire. Huh. Nice I hope I get a part of a uh, portable. Uh, I really hope I get a portable radio sometime soon.
I am so concerned right now. Just breathe, ever be, everything will be fine. Also think of Rex. Everything will be fine. This is a good play. Yes. I will definitely say the uh, atmosphere of this game is on point. They did a fantastic job with that, at least. That is the here. in here. Oh, a bunch of containers to loot. Nice. Oh! Backpack. A backpack! Backpack, 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 backpack. Is it bigger than the one you got? No. Oh. <laughs> I was hoping to take it, but no. Recommended tools, scrapper for the TV. Okay. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Free copper wire. A dresser with a whole bunch of fabric, which I'm pretty sure were clothes at some point. <laughs> All right, I should probably. Okay, I guess I can't deconstruct that. Why we need that? Can't deconstruct that. Radiation hazard? But there's loot. A pothole? Oh god! Ooh. I like the plot hole. Okay. Now you can go in. What's stopping you? Oh! Apparently I can just use these... Walk into these wa uh, rocks to... The radiation meter looks like. Oh yeah, my, my health was dropping very quickly there. Oh, not very quickly. Slowly enough, I can probably loot this stuff if I'm fast. As long as that doesn't have radiation on it. That would be funny. I forgot, yeah. the Fallout have like the Fallout had it where I don't have radiation on it. You pick it up and keep it. I'm not sure because I've never played any follow games. I maybe 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 Rygon knows. I don't think the food is bad. I don't think having I've, running persons is bad. I will. I've played Fallout 4, and I know that the armor. I forgot what they call it. It's the the walking mech thing. The walking armor does the power the armor. There we go. Doesn't because you gotta grab the uranium core Wait. and power it up. Is that a person? Huh? No, this is a doll. Being that maybe. Uh. No, I don't think no. that's a person. Um. No. Wait, what is that? What was that? All that colors back? Do you saw that? Yeah, I that see it. Uh... I don't think I want to mess with it. Yeah, I think that's closing in. That looks like an aurora on the ground. It does. You've been here for a pretty long time. Let's uh, move on to the next place. 
gonna be more. A hand vac. Can I craft that? No, I cannot. But I can craft a crude headlight. Oh. I don't want to use all my road flares for it. Mm. Use canned food. Certain dried or canned foods can last a remarkably long time in storage, and the expiry date is only ever a guide, right? I'm assuming that that heals me, based on the symbols here. Okay, it does heal me. I hear something. That was just the character eating. I hope so. Unless. Let's just close this, move on. Oh, good idea. That's where. What is that? You got a long road ahead of you, too. Indeed. Yes, yes, I do. Something is screaming at me back there! Fucking Pokemon scale. Hey, Essex! Take a Wendigo. God. <laughs> now, if only I could just, you know, have you in the back seat here, Rex. Then I can sit in the safety of the car, and if you, uh, you know, get in trouble, I just drive off, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone don't like these kind of games? Oh, Spooky he does have a good advice. It sucks, but it's good advice. What's the advice? Oh, stream safe music? I didn't even think about that. Uh. Ah. Yeah, let's just, uh. It's really nice when games do that. Thank you for that, Spooky. Okay. So that thing's gonna zap me. Yeah. Uh... Your car is your shield. Your car can protect you from radiation, anomalies, and the many other dangers of the zone, but only as long as it's in good condition. Keeping your doors closed and car parts in good condition will give you a de dependable barrier from the zone. If your car's health meter drops into the red, you'll be at risk. There are many ways to make repairs on the go. Be sure to check your crafting options to see what you can replace, and you may find helpful tools as you rummage around in the zone. Oh, good to know. So, pothole. Answer phone. Oh, I am not paused right now. Okay, let's just sit in the car then. While I read this. Uh. Pothole! Answer phone message transcript. Origin unknown, February 12th, 1966. Hey boss, so I'm out here working with Mira. Actually, Rex, you read this. Hey boss, so I'm out here working with Mira and Tobias from Maintenance, and I'm afraid I've got some bad news about our gear. 
We've run into some trouble, and I don't think we're getting it back from any time soon. Sorry, bad start of my first pothole jo holding job. Come when you get this, or better still, I think you should just come down here and see for yourself. Our tools, our signs, our lights, they've all... They've... They've all... Taken flight! So to speak. <laughs> really, I'm, I'm serious. I'm dead serious. You should see this. You know how you told me we were normal people working in a very abnormal place? I think I know what you mean now. Okay. Private field notes, Dr. Everett, date unknown. Raharu, read. Private field notes, Dr. Everett, date unknown. Plasma power spark transmitter, providing previously obsolete coils with limb hazard meter, have proven to be the best way to boost signals throughout the zone. Because of the increase in radiation and the electromagnetic interference has made radio communication extremely difficult and often subject to star distortions. These new modified coils appear to have solved that. The addition of local plasma power sources is a reliable way to keep each node with its battle infrastructure both operational and independent. However, right, the price you have to pay is constant maintenance and repair. The demanding bees and they're demanding bees and burn through tunnels rapidly. If key resistors and capacitors are not regularly replaced, they, quick, they quickly develop a habit of either shorting or even releasing constant high voltage, low current discharges into the immediate vicinity. Okay. That's terrifying. Indeed. Let's wait for this to zap somewhere else. Try to run up here okay. and break this quickly. Burn out, burn out. Cool. Oh, nice. All right, that's down now. Oh, so break the so break its power source. Yeah, simple enough. And for what? Okay, so what breaks? A gun. Do you have to get close to it? Uh, if only. That's a noise. <laughs> Sorry, I'm practicing the trombone. Or the same paint size go away. Sword. Essex, come join voice. Don't hang out nearly enough. Yeah, go ahead, Tanya. Yeah, more people means more voices to that you can use for our uh, use for the other thing. <laughs> hey, the Tanya. Those are words. Those are words. Yeah, hello. Hey, buddy. What's up? Hello, Tana. What's up is I'm playing Minecraft with Caddy. Hi, Caddy. Caddy's, uh, Caddy's making his first forays into redstone, and I just finally got my hands on nether wart, so I am burning off a massive stockpile of uh, potion ingredients. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh, that hurt. Ow. Well, pass along my hi to Caddy. Um, it, I wasn't I wasn't aware that it was contagious. Well, it is now. <laughs> contagious hi. This is why I don't deal with the fair folk. Aww. Aww. He's a good boy. I'm not gonna smash these. Mm. Oh god. That one got. If it started going towards you, that would be worse. Ow! Oh! oh. oh okay, man. I Maybe definitely think I'm gonna well, need like you're to. One of the old gorilla radio stations. That ought to be prime pickings for antenna parts. I've loaded its approximate location to your map. 
Look for an antenna tower uh, up on a hill somewhere. <laughs> okay. Uh, this is safe to drive, though. Find out. Evil cackling. Oh. Um, <laughs> sp speaking of fair folk, I, I, I really feel like, I know he's not here, but I feel like uh, Kerr and Domino would appreciate this. I may have kind of sort of gotten myself into the Dwarven Book of Grudges because I bred too many fairies. You what? You what? <laughs> Is there an echo? I, I, I managed to retrieve some Olays and bring them back to my base, and um, our mines happen to have multiple Amethyst Geodes in them, so I've been breeding Olays by the dozen to the extent that uh, Caddy's brother said that any Olays that make their way down into his mine are just getting killed on sight now. Oh. Ah! So the right. dwarves and the fair folk are now at war. <laughs> What's going on? Why is my screen... Uh, you, healed, you healed, I guess, did you? Uh, I your screen's frozen. Maybe it's time mm -hmm. to go. Oh, logbook. Okay. Uh, logbook. There it goes. The stream was locked um, up at my end. Weird. That is. Oh. This? Oh, you can replay audio. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can replay all of the uh, things. Uh... Okay, so this one we've already read, listened to. Got that. Okay. What was popping up? It looked like there was something that I was... The green? On top and bottom of your screen? No, the little thing, the log thing, and the right. Hmm. Oh, no. I wish you read it already, but... I... There's something glowing back there. I don't like it. I'm just gonna Bye. move on. It's just me. What you doing? Hey, yo, what the bunny doing? <laughs> <laughs> what the bunny isn't doing? Hey, Balazar. I do not know how long that message was sitting there before I noticed it. Oh, Sorry. it just popped in. <laughs> Okay. I'm assuming that that wall is not something I want to go through. No, oh, that I, I mean, you are the call. Gas, overlock, be. camping. Oh, overlook, camping. Okay. What is that? Uh, uh, something to stay away from, apparently. Looks like stuff. That's oh, great. Sketchy. Perfect time for the page to glitch out for me. Come on, Ooh. Twitch. Quit being stupid. Huh. Great studio. <laughs> I'm just going to close the browser entirely. Let's avoid that. It is went back. To oh, no, it's coming back. This is when I would save scum. I would save and then drive into it and see what happens. That's not something I, I think I, I, I don't think I can do that. Let's go, uh... Oh, there's another oh, oh. one! Another one. And another one. And another one. It's only two. What is 
Abductor, Abductor yeah. apparently. Uh oh. We're sick of the call. I said it. Like I said, it's just me. Come on, come back. No. <laughs> no. All right, Tanya, you get to read. Oh. Okay. Letter fragment. Date unknown. Dear Maggie, once again, I miss you and the kids so much. I'm sorry I haven't written sooner, but it's been just crazy out here. I have a few moments right now, so I figured it would be good to put, a, put pen to paper. I hope you don't mind the handwriting being so wiggly, but me and the guys are in a bit of a pickle right now. You see, our van got pulled up into a tree. I'm afraid I... Ah, screen scroll. I'm afraid I can't explain exactly what happened. Top secret things and all. But we're safe. Trust me on that. We also have two hours to wait before rescue comes, hanging 50 feet above the ground and right on a ridge. We also have two hours to wait before rescue comes, hanging 50 feet above the ground and right on a ridge. I'll send this as soon as we get back to barracks and write you a much better letter after. But in the meantime, here's a picture. I sketched it out while we were waiting. If there's one thing we have up here, it's a heck of a view. Love always, Joe. Interesting. Okay, sure so I guess those things will, uh... I'm going to do what I should have done at the beginning of that. I'm going to start watching it on the Discord stream, not the Twitch stream. Yeah. <laughs> the delay. Oh, buddy rocks. I think you're getting something. Your radioactivity. Oh, crap, I am. Can I actually... Oh, it's the it's baby color. That seems sketchy in there, but okay. You have a light? Yes. They are temporary lights, but I have lights. Nice. It's a good thing radiation is not explosive. For like a radi for, for the radiation, not a gas that can explode. That's, I was about yeah. to say, um, radiation has a reputation of being very explosive. Uh, anomaly? <laughs> Tourist. Good. Is that a petrified individual? I don't know. We'll find out when we get back to the car. I swear Anakin. that's just weeping angels. I don't trust it. Neither do I. Why is it? Why? Why are there floating rocks inside the inside? Some kind of anomaly. I see. It's an alamani. Alamani. Private. Alamani. Okay. Nice. Why the pan? I almost have an entire chest full of potions now. I feel like I'm pushing. I think it's time to leave. I think so. Where did it go? There it is. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, oh, God! No, no, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Escape. What the hell is that? The That's the abductor. The abductor. And it just abducts things. him with a plunger. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh boy. That, that, was so that was both that was that was both scary and hilarious. <laughs> it's if it's slapping you with a plunger, I think it's saying you're full of something. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. It might okay, be let's uh, car, go though. look at the uh, tourists apparently. <sighs> Shadow. Me? Alright, hold on a minute. Dick to the phone recording office of Dr. Richard Pre Preble, circa 1976. <clears throat> Sorry. Hi, Christina. Hi. How are you? So, um, it turns out you were right. We've had reports from several regions of the zone now, and they're all very similar. We have these dummy things out in the wilderness, and um, 
We also have them inside abandoned houses. On the road. We also have them in gas stations, on the road. That radio signs. station's up on a hill somewhere. One rep Eyes to the horizon. One report here says on a roof. We spawn about 600 now. The file catalogs each and every one. Oh, and you're quite and you're quite right about the other thing too. Yeah, I know what happens when someone touches one. We all got plenty of data on that. So um, I'm gonna be applying for a position in Portland now. I've done my review. It was great. It was a great time being contracted here, for sure. But I'm not sure I want to work at Arda full time, you know? It's, um... It's very strange here. You work in a very strange place. I'm sure you're doing very important work, and I respect that greatly. But I think I'd like to go back to Damien now. Oh god, there's one of them outside. I know for a fact that wasn't there before. Okay. That was that was some really nice r r narration, Shadow. Yeah, I don't even do that for a living. <laughs> <clears throat> um, yeah. Let's uh, let's get out of here. Get out of here. If you go left, you're going to go into a dead end. You have to go There's to the right path. You want to keep going. There's something down there, though. And look, another one here. I think the abductors take the vehicles, but I don't know. This well, they said my car is my shield. I'm going to trust that. Your stream, not mine. Okay, let's go run Stream Raiders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's go to some Stream Raiders. So we know not to touch the Taurus, whatever those are. Indeed. Those things that we saw there. Yeah, let's not touch them. I know, I don't. Rex is a good boy, 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 Rex is a good boy. Essex! Hello. Hello. Hello there. I was told to join here. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, we don't nice. get to hang out nearly enough. Yeah, it's I nice don't come here too often. Nice to meet you too. Hello. Nice to meet. For those not aware. Artwolf Essex is also a streamer that you all should definitely go check out. No, it's ah. not, I, I'm just who someone that plays Epic Units all over Sims Battle all the time. Uh, <laughs> Logger? I just save up, save up all the Epic Potions just for Sim. Ah, uh, for Stream <laughs> But no, you should definitely go follow Essex before he gets banned again. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what was he doing to get he's banned? A, he's a contact. Well, I got banned. Um, I got mass reported the same day and uh, no one day, and then uh, Twitch automatically banned me for sexual implication on username. Oh. Oh. Gee. Oh my god. Uh, wait, did you get bot raided? 
Um, no, just mass report. Hmm. So I guess they kind of bot raid. Bot raid, troll raid, that's some sort of one or the other. Right. <clears throat> Reminds yeah. me of a game that I was playing. That I, I played for a little bit once upon a time. There was a um, it was basically just a Chineseium version of um, World of Warships. That oh usernames God. on that game, if they contained any uh, string of letters, which is also a string of letters that appears in any banned words, then that isn't allowed, either in usernames <laughs> or in chat. So, for example, the word assassin, it would <laughs> let you uh, send the word assassin. If you send it, it would just yeah. be star, 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 I am. <laughs> oh, God. And I'm sure you can imagine how many other words, considering they had a very strict word list, also yeah. ended up just transmitting to stars. To be fair, there Ooh. are some games that have a... That, that have a, a, that, that have a um, chat filter that is almost as silly as that, but not quite. There's what? Well, I think it's because There's the Chinese... Oh, there is. I think it's because the um, chat filter was originally meant for Chinese, and they had to ah. adapt it for English. Mm. Ah. Yeah, that makes sense. And some well, words are... a fun are... game, regardless. And some words are safe for work in the U.S. in present uh, in, Chi in China, so... It may also be that it's just totally, uh, totally different being too fast. OH GOD! The, 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 the Chinese characters are over, oh, over, the, over the Latin alphabet. Is that tourist? No, either way. Yeah. Yeah, oh! Woo! Keep oh, looking at him, no. keep looking at him, keep looking at him, keep looking at him, keep looking at him. And leave. I was right. I don't know. It's a sweeping angel, isn't it? Yep. Oh, this anymore. Oh. oh it's not there anymore. Ha ha! Oh, yeah. oh, no, it's still there. Ha ha! Nice. I'm cool with that. That's, I'm cool with that 100%. What a uh. drive. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> was, yeah, like, no. was that a tourist? Did, the same so, um, thing? That was into a, them. That, that that was a tourist, and yes, uh, solution is drive into him. So I guess you could say Zim ran over a tourist and can't <laughs> get in trouble for it. Oh my god. Am I wrong on you? I don't no, want to be wrong. implicated in this. Mm -hmm. this is yep. for that. I was gonna so stay here to making energy drinks if you don't mind. <laughs> I could use an energy drink right now. I could probably go make one. I have a bottle with it. I, I, I'm currently on the section of the uh, potions list where I'm making the uh, swiftness potions. And Are so you I could make uh, Minecraft. Oh, right. I, I could. No, no. Minecraft. Now, see, I, I could be using glowstone in order to make really potent uh, uh, potions of swiftness. But no, I'm, I'm using the redstone. So basically, it is an energy drink, not a speed boost. On that note, uh, Paint, how long are we going for? Because I could take a little bit of an energy drink. I could make one out of water bottles of this powder, but that's only if we're going for a little bit more. It's like an hour. I'll call it okay. the work. Blank. I have some, okay, I have some white powder, I have some red powder, and I have some uh, mushrooms. If I put these together in a bottle, it'll make it move really fast mm. for a while. <laughs> so, Rex, uh... I cannot save uh, mid venture with this game. Uh huh. So, floating. however long it takes me to get done with this. Uh, look at your map one more time. Please. Yeah. I'm gonna go get a drink. Probably a good <laughs> idea. I, I think I need to get here. Get, yeah. We're gonna go get a drink. Yeah. While getting everything else. Have a good, uh, have a good drink, Rex. Don't drink. drink. And drive. No, no. <laughs> Not. No. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, we okay. as adults are going to we have to break. We have to break culture for a hot minute. We gotta be the mature ones here. No drinking and driving, please. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Drink. No. And grand no, larceny. No, no, no. <laughs> no? Oh. 
that's gonna get Zim in trouble because we're all gonna be affiliated that he has it the pu with the corrupt with the punishments. Oh, Which means we're all gonna have to deal with it. I'm curious enough, I'm gonna Oh god, there's a tourist over there. Oh I'd go get abducted. They don't make noise at the coil heads and lethal company, do they? Aha! I found something what? interesting. How do you? Uh, Anchor plug? Neato. I feel like this is not something I want to be messing with. Probably not. That's something most of the things in this game. <laughs> Fair point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't surprise me if that tourist that you ran over was from that building that you left the door open to. I'm pretty sure it was. But they're also out in the middle of the woods here, apparently. Yeah. Oh, duh, plug. Uh. Oh, duh, no. plug. <laughs> no. Oh, duh, plug. We'll go plug. do that. Oh boy. You well, we're gonna read what the logbook says about these first. Let me in the car while doing this. Alright, I will get out my voice for this. Anchor block. Alright, go for it, Rygon. Alright. Private Field Notes, Dr. Mensa, March 30th, 1970. We have now completed the process of standardizing and replacing all of the anchor mounts and infrastructure. These new mounts should be far more durable, steadfast against weather and atmospheric changes, and resistant to any corrosion. This has been a lengthy and difficult process, marred by endless delays. It is my hope that most of these mounts will hold on for at least 50 years, but many projections suggest two or even three hundred. Hmm. That's far longer than many anchors themselves. This was, I believe, worth it. As usual, I'll be compiling and submitting a full casualty list by 1,000 oh. hours tomorrow morning. At that time, I'll begin to notify next of kin. Wait, wow. Be, be careful. So we just carefully pull it. Why did you do that? A uh, what? You told him to get it! <laughs> get back to the car, quick! Oh god. Go, go, go! Go! I don't know what's blowing up back there, but yeah! Don't be there, don't be there! Get to the car, pull it. Uh, can you just like drive with it in put, your hand? Put it, put it into the side seat. Put it in the side seat? Yeah, Put the side seat. Ah. Oh, okay, cool. cool! Now get in. Yeah, cool. Okay, go, 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 Something's coming. What? Right. <laughs> Don't say that in the type of game you play. Don't say that. Dude, this I just turned to paint. Something's coming. <laughs> radical! <laughs> After only saying radical for five hours. They're coming. Radical! <laughs> you didn't use a lot of that silly putty on the car, did you? I uh, used uh, a lot, actually, yes. Oh, fair enough. It still looks like uh, not great. <laughs> it's functioning. It drives. It's drivable, right now. It's, it's moving. Oh, what did I do? What horrible thing have I committed? This all-terrain is a front-wheel drive. I have no idea. You seem to be going back. Oh yeah, there was a... Yeah, you're, there. you're trying to cra craft some replacement parts for like your panels and stuff. Some cars you can break if you want to stop it where it's totally so safe on the road. Yeah, you're more or less fine. Um, but pulling that particular thing, I, I guess you haven't gotten to that part of the uh, tutorial yet. Nope. But essentially, uh, it's going to be your way out. 
Oh. So that's how it gets out. Nice road to free music. Yeah, take a look at your car's health there. You do you see any like missing parts? I see I see oh, a couple. Yeah. You're gonna wanna craft replacements for those parts specifically to move on with this tutorial. Okay. Good to know. Not sure I did it. Yeah. Wait, why is why was there red? Uh, might have been the lightning, but I have yeah. no idea. It's possible we got electrocuted a little bit there. Yeah. A little zappy zap. What does that say? Mm -hmm. Why is that red? What? what? Uh, uh, I don't know what that is. You're telling me you've never seen mm -hmm. that before? Can you take a picture no. of it? I think you should go lick it. Lim no! I mean... I think everyone's like first tutorial map is me? different, so I don't know what's in it. This is just a tutorial map. It's been pretty dangerous so far. I guess so. I mean, has the lady been talking to you? Not much. A little bit, a little bit but not much. Um, she's supposed to be talking to you pretty in depth. I mean, that's how it was for me anyway. She she just wouldn't shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's been pretty chill so far. She yeah. Go to the light. Oh, I see. You're been... you're trying to locate the radio station. Yes. Anomaly studies. In storing fax machine. Okay. Yeah. Check that. I don't know what that said is. That the that she put it on the map. And I thought he went to it, but I have no idea. No, I don't oh, think I have. Bit. Oh, then you're probably just on a random journey then. Yeah, I kind of got sidetracked. I'm looting. It's a looting no, game! I'm looting everything! No, I mean, like, like, you might be on legitimately, like, the wrong map. Oh, no, I am supposed to go to a radio station. Okay. You just said she marked on the map. Oh, yeah, but I didn't go to it yet. Right. See, this is what I thought you'd like about Lethal Company, but the gameplay loop was kind of... Well, this Lethal like... Company, I think, is is good. It's it's just need it's just under development. A lot of the... probably mods, mods, honestly, probably. I think make it better. Yeah. Okay, I'm way this... too curious. Oh no! Oh, no. Pun. Bye. Curiosity killed the Martin. There. I got a bad feeling about this. You gonna take the car? I don't know. That looks that looks pretty pretty that hot. Looks really sketchy. Can we scan it? Oh. Ah. Checkpoint. <laughs> Hilarious. Huh. Royal boy, Alalis. Uh, they apparently want you to press a, enter or tab one of the two. Access check checkpoint. Uh... You have access to. Oh, okay. Well, that could have been worse. Yeah, that definitely could have been worse. No. <laughs> oh. Nah, it just turned out as bureaucracy. Mm -hmm. We're all like, no, let's not go through this red thing. Zim, I'm gonna go through the red thing. We all look at it. Oh, it's just the exit. It'd be a great infantry <laughs> person for like SCPs. Oh, fuel barrel, that's interesting. And here you have a, you know, lit flare right next to it. That's, that's great. <laughs> that's, <laughs> right. that, that's perfect. Jesus. Goodbye. Yeah, nothing's better than that moment when you light up a flare to read a label and the label says, warning, explosive. <laughs> me in the car watching his paint just walk up to him with a flare. What are you doing over there? What you doing over there? Everyone else looking at it. Tur turns into the damn scene. You know what the dog doing? <laughs> it turns into the damn scene from Zoolander playing with gasoline. Ha <laughs> Just gasoline up each other. Oops. Jeez. Oops, it is. I would watch Zoolander now. <laughs> there. I think your, I think your car's got a little bit of a droopy eye there. I think it's a character. So. It's character. <laughs> Let's see. It's personality. 
It's perfect. No, that's not fun. that's not bumper. It's a panel. Oh, okay, well you had a bumper you needed anyway. Never mind. Oh yeah, that's it what works. I was purposely building. Oh and well, you looked the at the panel. panel. I'm like, no, that's that's a panel. Get mixed up. <laughs> I've never been able to build a lot of this stuff now. Okay, must have been really good those parts while we've been out here. Uh, need more of that paste. Thing. I think there was one more on the front. Yep. Yeah, another panel. You got more of that goop. You got that goop. You ever about that goop? I'm not gonna use the goop unless I need it. It's a limited Dude, resource. All right, looks like you more. fixed everything you needed to. How do you get more goop from where that goop? Run! Oh, you gotta What's make it. You gotta make the goop. What the goop do with? Goop <laughs> I right, I take a look at the at uh, the map real quick and zoom out. Oh. All right, you see those yellow things? Those, those yellow are your things. way out. Oh. oh. In the forest. Oh. Off the path. Uh, that, I think you were supposed to go to that green beacon like a long time ago. Probably. But I got sidetracked. Let's go there. Martin. I just got sidetracked. Let's go Lo adventuring. Exploring. Page. Some more things. Looting. Right on. The simple answer. Looting is fun. You thought the yeah, possibility well, it's of like, death It's like they spawned you right in front of a treasure chest and you completely ignore the treasure chest for like little pebbles on the ground. No, the That's treasure chest is way the hell down there. We, just, <laughs> we spawned on the top of the map, did we? Oh, you spawned on the top? Okay, yeah. that makes sense. We've been going down the road. Dude, they're not that bad. <laughs> Cobalt braid's not that strong. The big shiny would have been the first shiny. <laughs> Like, canonically, I feel like we're all like different iterations of a GPS of the same call. We're all just speaking. It's like, you should go here. Inspector, it's just like, there's a treasure chest way over here. What are we doing here? Recalculating. Recalculating. Error. Did I help? Tell you that. For sure, the windows will turn left. Blue waypoint. I'm a Snoop Dogg GPS. <laughs> Listen, listen, I know you like that blue waypoint, but the green one seems more important. We gotta get that Re one. Look at all those cars you can solve. Reduce speed to zero yeah, miles Yeah, solve hour. the cars, Paint. Unlock solve the your door. own car, Paint. <laughs> listen to the familiar on your shoulder that likes to see you solve things. I <laughs> <laughs> need another I scrap of oh. Yes, oh. you need I all was, the scrappers. Was... Saw and Paint. Saw them. Okay, what's was... up, Tony? Yes! Tanya? What are you trying to say, Tanya? I had oh, so a party, real. but it was like two minutes ago. Fine. Darn. You know what was that? Dead sauce? That was you not talking. Saw faster. Wait, what is... A bollard? Uh oh, get in the car. Get in, get in the car. Don't solve the thing you don't know what it is yet. Transmission fragment, origin unknown. Yes, Anita, get the fuck away from here. <laughs> There's a thing in the forest. <laughs> there, get out of there. <laughs> it's just like, oh hey, what's this log book description? Get the fuck out. <laughs> I'm gonna say that next time you start looking at one of the things in front of you. <laughs> Um, yeah, what you were. That's a noise. Yeah, uh, Rex, I've been practicing my mm. Sugi horn. I've been playing the Wait. horn recently. Hey, move. But what you were. Oh, yeah. the the thing that's. Uh, Get the fuck out of there! Get in the car. Get in the car now. At least we can read what it is. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Saw it. It's it's kind of moving slowly towards you, but I hope it's not nothing anything that bad. Wait, moving? Is it moving? You're the one that said it was moving. I don't know. It's important that we saw this car, though. The quicker we saw this car, the quicker we could leave. Agree. All right. As one of the many voices from this GPS. <laughs> She's um, going up and or down and then back up. Giggity? No. Q. Stop. How much? Oh ye. Yeah. Alright, let's get out of here pretty soon. That is pretty weird though. Nah, that's a lot of scrap metal. Yeah. 
Yeah, more than I feel like right. you need eye protection for this. I know, right? Yeah, I've got goggles. What? Oh, it's coming back. Wait, why what? is over there now? That's not where it was before. It, it's vibing. I don't think you can stall anything else. Oh, there you go. You can scrap the engine. Scrap the engine. So whoever thought this was going to be a uh, game for Zim, you were 110% right. <laughs> he uh, takes a dude oh, collecting never mind. stuff like that. I thought it said it. Martin good. Brain must I, collect the shinies. It says recommended tool is scrapper, but... Okay. For some reason, like, pop on top, when, you said, when you said it says recommended, my brain auto-completed the rest of that sentence too. It said recommended ages 5 and up. That's good for me. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> what is that game that said that it was about being on a train and you have four people and you do um, like this kind of stuff? Galaxy Train or something? I can't remember. It was a train in game. In space? Void Train? Yeah, Void Train. Is that what it was? Is it good? Or, where you're that's on a, a rail that's just kind of floating in this void. That's a game I think that I was going to give to you and say like we should probably, because this is reminding me of that now. It, that is it, a game it, that I definitely game. have an interest in. Okay, I'll yeah, put it on the a, list. It's a great party game. As far as single player goes, um... It went down a path where it doesn't take itself seriously in the slightest after starting out on that path, taking itself yeah. very seriously. Yeah. So it's in a, it's got that kind of weird limbo feel to it. But, if, but if you're able to ignore that, the gameplay itself is actually pretty solid. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's something I've been meaning to like get into. It's never really jumped in. But after seeing this and seeing the kind of gameplay you're vibing with, I think Boy Train would be perfect for a four-player group game. Because it's like this... But on a train, in the void, it's pretty neat. You don't say. I know. Yeah. Don't, don't a game familiar. called Void Train has a train in the void? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> the gameplay loop is like this a little bit. You're going through a, a bunch of anomalies, mm -hmm. you're collecting scraps, you're constantly building the thing you're riding on. Mm -hmm. And yes, you're right. I, I just um, totally... That thing, oh, I don't I'm think good. it's moving, but it definitely seems to be getting taller. It's getting yeah. taller. What? You want to tell him to read that little thing about Aneta? Maybe it says, like, the more you look at it, the closer you are to it, the bigger it gets or something. Man. The pillar is this much closer in the mirror. <laughs> Objects in the mirror are a bit closer than they appear. Don't just charge the spooky thing! Lick it. Martin! <laughs> lick it. Honey! It'll give you more time. read about this it. thing before you run at it. You could just die by looking... You have a ri I know you know what SCPs are. There's like 20 different things that can happen to you right now from running up on that thing. <laughs> 20 different things that can happen to you just from looking at it if it's an SCP. You have familiar who's telling you to leave. You have GPS voice one that's telling you to leave. You have, you, you have notes you've completely ignored. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, yeah, Pam wants to lick it and mark it right now. Hey, you can't <laughs> mark the <laughs> weird yeah. miracle thing that keeps coming out of the ground. But it <laughs> looks like GPS. a fire hydrant. Last, no, no, I need no. your help. Last, <laughs> GPS voice two is the one that's been corrupted. And it's just you have to remember always do the opposite of what it says. There's so many things to mark in this oh, forest. Yeah. You know what? I'm just gonna be an enabler. Yeah, keep keep getting the scraps, and we should probably mark that baller before we leave. <laughs> no, don't do that. No. <laughs> How else are they gonna know it's ours? It's ours, right? We saw yeah. it first. Oh my We've been in this territory first. It's our territory now. No, no, we are friends to find this. Y'all sound pissy. <laughs> How's the pack gonna know where, where we are if we don't mark where we're going? It's only logical. Right. What do you mean inventory oh. full? Oh. How dare? Have a limit. <laughs> uh, that's because that. That's because that's a gear. It takes up more space. Oh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. It's almost like Lethal Company. You can only hold so much. I wonder how many anomalies are in this thing. Also, I love how the more and more games are coming out, the more we're seeing stuff inspired by SCPs that are actually just like finally oh, getting the out. That's because SCPs yeah. are, you know, interesting. Yes. Yes. What, like I, I, Malo? It's been a thing where they've always been open source and like you just haven't really seen anything, but like I love that you're well, we're seeing devs finally create stuff around those ideas. Yeah, yeah. Just, SCPs, they, they, they started out as a really niche thing and it was a really small community that was making them, but it's been growing a lot. The list of people that have been contributing is getting bigger and bigger. Heck, even I've like, written an SCP, I just haven't actually gone through its properly submitting yeah. it yet. 
what I like about it is I'm not really seeing like the games that I've been seeing. Like I'm not seeing like SCP Lab, SCP Lab 2, SCP, like like when the whole backroom thing's happening. I don't really care so much for the backroom, 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 backroom. I love seeing stuff like this. It's like you can tell they grew up with it, but they're making their own ideas and they're kind of going off and they're bouncing yeah. off cryptids and stuff. That's what I like to see. Also, did you say back lab? Backrooms. Oh, that's Sorry. not a good. Thing. I heard back lab. <laughs> Wait, not wait. Okay, listen to uh, what is that? Oh, nothing. Ignore me. No, don't ignore the person who played the game before. I think if I think if Rygon says something's bad, you probably should take the. That, that's a green thing over there. Why is that green? Uh, I think that's the abductor. Uh, uh, those things aren't scary. The real scary okay. things are those. Um, I hate things that like lose the uniform. Hug the abductor. Oh, wait a minute. The okay, the let's go do that uh, reading thing. Bollard! Go for it, Rex! Oh, sure, okay. <clears throat> Transmission, fragment, origin unknown, March 21st, 1961. Uh, yes, Anita, I do agree with you on that. This is nothing short of remarkable. And yes, I also think that we're, we are seeing here is something new and unique. Something unmatched by anything the Zone has previously offered up. But I must disagree with your conclusions. Strongly. I strongly disagree. These abrupt, dangerous, grotesque things are one of a host of bizarre... Things are one of a host of bizarre new geological phenom phenomena. They very likely occur in response to the ground vibrations or... Did I miss something? <laughs> I can't see. Uh, and I think that's the end of it. To suggest that they are a deliberate reaction, even a defense mechanism, takes our discussion in a very different and quite uncomfortable direction. I think we should be reviewing your reports. After I get done sipping this drink. <laughs> Before you submit them, this conversation goes no further than until you scroll down a little bit more, and I'll be... Moving that mouse in a second so I can see what scrubbing is. Oh, scrubbing the transmission. <laughs> why are you making this harder for me? The transmission is long as soon as possible. Pictures, understand. That's why making it harder for you. <laughs> Rex, Rex, what the heck? <laughs> I am oh not God. purposely making it harder. It's just. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Rex, you're a goober. Look, he's not making it harder on purpose. It just does that when it's around you. <laughs> oh, funny. Oh. Why? Actually, that is a wow. very good voice. <laughs> I mean, on that. I can't wait till I get a new voice line quote because I've been hearing that so much. I don't mind it. Like, I, want, I need, a, I need a new one. <laughs> that you? Wait, that's your that was Yes. Why yeah, do you, you think it's know. labeled as Rex Broken? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you I need those early on when Rex was here. He can make that noise, yes. You're right now from the source. Big day. Oh, this is. Okay, radioactive. Oh, I gotta. Oh, God. What? How bad is it? M store tourist. You need power armor. Oh, there's a tourist. Run that bitch over. It says you're familiar. Rar. Hi, it's your GPS. It's all, it also say run over the tourist. Embrace the tourist. Yeah, with your car. You're a stranger oh. in this land. Embrace with the front of your car. Embrace with yeah. your arms. Embrace with the arms of your car. Well, uh, Side door. Uh, yeah. you. Show them this is a welcoming, friendly community. Don't listen <laughs> to this GPS voice. They, this, this GPS AI has been corrupted. Master, so real though. Master, I suggest that you give that uh, mannequin a dope boop with the front of your bumper. I will <laughs> happily do this. After I finish looting this place. Uh, I GPS AI want to insist that you stop looting. Stop being a loot goblin and run know, over the I, I don't know how you're doing this without like full on anxiety right now. I would have to run over that thing before I started looting. <laughs> it's the same reason why we uh, don't re really react too much in the horror games. Yeah. Do it. What? Do it. Poop the snoot. Does it bother you? It, Ow. it could be behind. What are you any waiting moment. for? Poop the snoot. Oh, don't, don't go out the door. If you go out that door, it's gonna know you're there. Poop. 
Jeez. Oh, you're at 50%. Is that a chicken mannequin? No, look at the. No, no, no. Go back to the table. No, 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 no. No, no, no. That was no, a bear. Please go. Uh, it looked like a chicken. It, it looked a like bear. a bear. It was a bear statue. Okay, how do you think? How do you confuse that uh, bear? Secret room? Uh. Not on my end. I didn't see it for that long. No. Ah. Alright. Just refresh the, the stream. And yeah. yeah, of course we can't trust I Rex's the eyesight. They're currently made of fart. I remember that reference. <laughs> <laughs> hey, anybody want a TF Rex? Especially on that note. <laughs> I hey, look, it's a me in there. Can you spot me in there? I have, I'm, I'm in there somewhere. In the way. Yeah, you're probably. Uh, I think it's a pink thing. The easily pink thing. thing. <laughs> the pink thing. The pink thing. You got it. Good job. Congratulations. You did a lot. To whoever Yay. threw the TF Rex. It's a, <laughs> might I suggest the chicken mode? Fallen heart. No, no. Mm -hmm. He just goes through the. Uh, he he goes through the uh oh the uh, little oh. mental forms. Ah yeah. okay. and I, I rolled to chicken was on the table. I I rolled to determine which one. Ah uh... Do you wanna be a chicken though? No. You seem to talk about chickens a lot. Do you wanna be a chicken? No, I rather it eat does a sound like he wants to be a chicken. I could no. turn him into a chicken. I think I probably no. can do it. He does that. like turkey no. jerky yeah, after all. Or turkey uh, Why bacon. Why do you want to be a rooster? Yeah. And we all know I'm chickens gonna... are cannibals. All right, you know Ramaru wants a TF Rex. Burr! Earth. Yeah. Wind, water, earth, go, planet. Let's go, powers combined. I am changing. <laughs> Are you trying to recite the Avatar Last Airbender? Oh, you hurt me, sir. Oh, you hurt me. Oh, he was, oh, going, for me. Planet. He was <laughs> going for Captain Planet. That's uh, it. I'm turning you to a loaf of bread. You're turning in the bread. What? No. Why Hello oh, there, Taurus. It's bread. Oh my god. You're turning Eat in the bread. Zim, have you ever played I Am Bread? You are bread. No, I, I don't am think not. that's good Whoa. to run over. Yay! The Taurus yeah. exploded. What the hell? Yeah. Did that hurt your car a lot or what? Doesn't look Probably like did. it. Probably did. Let's take a look at the health of your vehicle. Doesn't it look that bad. Alright, yeah, you said so. It's not that bad. I think it's worth it. It's very cathartic. It's it, it's good. It, the, the value is very high about running those things over. Ooh, dumpster. And it's not friendly. Wait, it didn't open his mouth wanting trash? <laughs> no, that's just me when I get when I get home from work and I really need something to eat. Spectre, <laughs> what are you doing in the trash? What are you what doing? You doing? I can't feed you trash. I can feed you breakfast. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's I wonder how many anomalies are, anom anomalies are in this game. Uh, hopefully enough. They probably become more and more like diverse and distinct as uh, you go to harder, harder locations if I had to take you guys. Mm -hmm. Is this a roguelike game? Hi there, Rob. This is randomized, uh, yeah. Hey, Not Rob. Entirely. Wait, you Rob, did, the robot suffering, buddy? Hey, Rob. You did say the beginning was different, right, than what you remember being playing? Yeah, this is a different map than what I played with. No, that means there is some kind of randomness to it. Nice. But rope lighting, um... <laughs> I mean, technically, there's rope like enemies, because you're, like, making your... What the heck? You're spinning like you're in a freaking... <laughs> <laughs> washing machine. You spin <laughs> me around. Spinning paint rounds. Round, 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 round. I love. I, I love. <laughs> I love how everybody began just singing different parts of the song at the same time. Me and Spectre started to begin. Call your name now, baby. I like. We need to all start in different parts when we sing it again because it'll be so, so chaotic. <laughs> oh my God. Watch out here, I got That's the next song. I feel like the screeching sound. And I'm not even trying to violate. A little bit closer. Shoot, I just realized um, we're all the car. We're all with the car. We are the SCP. We're all the voices that you hear whenever you're in the car. 
Well, they did say <laughs> they did say that I will form an attachment to the vehicle, to the remnant. Yes. One, oh, of us. Us. one of us. One of us. Y'all make sense now. <laughs> what, you think you're the first? Although this car's been around, buddy boy. Oh no, this, this car around. is brand new. But we are inseparable now. No, I think the first voice, canonically, will be Rex. All right, when you get back in the car, I guess I'm going to be your radio since we're doing stream-free music. I got to sing me songs and stuff. Yeah, okay. sing it. Well, I got to wait till we're in the car first. No, you're loud enough. We can still hear it from outside. I need to build a... make another one of these scrappers. Yee. What is this... what is this game call again? Uh, Pacific, Pacific Drive. Drive. Pacific wait. Drive. Interesting, interesting. I've seen some people play this game, and every time I saw it, it was like during some form of horror moment. I was like, nope, not my game. Not my <laughs> monkey, not my circus. I'm out of here. <laughs> not, I, I don't like horror games. I never have. And now, well, here you are. And we'll, we'll see how long this lasts. It's easier to watch than to play, trust me. Yeah. Like, I'm able, like, I can watch people come. Because most of the time, everyone's chatting and laughing their asses off. I wouldn't really Too call Lethal Company a horror game. Uh, it's kind of hard. I, mm, I, I tell you what, I tell you <laughs> what, until you play that game without the voice chat on, don't say that. If we played that game with voice chat on in-game, that shit gets legit scary sometimes. Especially when you're in the place by yourself. It does give you that sense of, like, phasmophobia-like horror. At least for me. At least for me. At least for me. Yeah, I can imagine, but at the same time, I, th I, th I think a sim is much more resistant to that than you are, Rex. Yeah, I don't know what would get Zim going, let me think. Well, I mean, this has been pretty much getting them, I think. We've actually been helping them with uh, atmosphere breaking, because the atmosphere for this game is pretty solid. The, the, the creepy things in the woods, the, the, the random screaming, and... Because if you we weren't here... Zim would not be playing as I would not be going off grabbing loot. He'd probably be going to the mission and then trying to find the quickest way out of here. Because remember, Taurus came out and we were, he jumped, we all jumped. It was like, wait, no, just stare at it, get in the car, well, and leave. Well, the thing <laughs> is, is that for me, fear is always of the un unknown. And uh -huh. in this situation, Okay, I know what the Taurus are, I know what they can do, or at least roughly, and I know how to kill them. Well, now. I can tell you a game that really set, set that kind of tone perfectly and made me, like, actually scared of its, its world. Outer Wilds was probably the scariest game I played. So much so that as soon as they let me out into the world, I had to stop playing. It was just Ooh. too much for me. The moment I could get into space and like start exploring, I was like, I don't think I can do this. <laughs> at, the at, at the Rex. Yeah, it was a really good game. Hold up. Very great atmosphere. Hmm? Huh? Hmm? Thought I heard whispering. <laughs> this is Essex in the background, just whispering, trying to talk. <laughs> Concerning. Okay, we're good. By the way, did you all know that Artie is cute? What? Definitely. What? No, really? No, like, no, like totally, like he's really possible. Is that is that Valley Girl? No. Okay, making sure. <laughs> like <laughs> OMG. Why do you like this? Why do you like this? Why do you like it? Why do you like doing oh that? God. Why do you like this? understand Valley Girl. Does he like understand? Oh my god, you're gonna totally die by a cryptid. That's crazy. You're gonna go into the void. <laughs> Be careful out there. You're gonna get scrambled. <laughs> it is dangerous. One starts and the others join in. This is uh. wonderful. <laughs> it's as bad as a yawn. The minute one starts, everyone gets it. It's definitely a good way to get out of fear state, I guess. 
Sure. Yeah. Definitely for you. That is a Wendigo? Those yeah, things not... kill you? Have fun. No, I don't. Tanya. Buddy. Tanya? No, I thought you were the chair. Okay, that streaming <laughs> is definitely getting closer. Time to leave. Yeah. No, I'm not. Yeah. Tanya, stop lying. I'm, I'm really okay. far away right now. <laughs> completely safe. I'm gonna have to ask you, is, is looting more important than your life right now? <laughs> You're asking a Martin. Oh, fuck. That There's is eggs cool. in the car. We have eggs no. in the car. Wait, technically, technically, that? paint's not a Martin. That's... Oh, they're a doggo. They like to explore and adventure. Oh. How, do you How do you pull over a freaking painted doggo? What do they eat? Now I'm actually gonna Google this. African dogs? Cats. I think they gotta eat everything they can. That's an excess. So, Pate, why are you uh, sawing that car up there? I'm curious. Resources? Oh. It insulted him. No, I need resources. The dogs are carnivorous and have marked prey like wildebeest, zebra, and impalas. My head can in this, uh... Wow, wow. cars, huh? Paint, Paint's looking for his ball. Isn't it back at the car? Come the car. Who pipes? No, don't, in, don't, in, no, th th thanks, Who pipes? Rex. What if you go inside of it? <laughs> thanks, Rex, thanks. No, you, you, I can't. Aw, bummer. Dang. Cool. The game has limits. Boom now. limits. Tanya, so don't Tanya, you're the universe. You're a Wendigo? I think you're like a, a GPS. Jack Loop. I am I am whatever's funniest in the moment. Ah. ah. Wait, what? That's terrifying. You know what's funny when you said that? Because I had the, like the window smaller, you turn into Uraharu. You turn. It's so almost like what? Whoa! And then, like, your, your, your image changed into Uraharu's. I was like, oh, I guess, I guess you are whatever's funniest in the moment. You changed to Uraharu. Well, I'm, I'm glad, to hear, glad to hear that I was the funniest thing for a moment. It's just it was fun to see Tanya just turn into the one. Yeah. I stole your face for practical joke purposes. You can have that. Oh wait, are you in the car? Are you, are you ready for music? Thank yes, you. I'm ready for music. Oh, this is a triumph. I'm making a note here, you success. You it's hard to overstate my satisfaction. satisfaction. Aperture science. We do what we must because we can. But are you the good of all of, of us, all except the except ones, who, ones are who are dead. <laughs> but there's no sense crying over every mistake. You just keep on trying till you run out of cake. And the science gets done, and you make a knee gun for the people who are still alive. Okay. Anywho. Keep going. Why, why, why were you singing, Rex? Whoa! Oh, we gotta play that game on stream. We gotta play that game on stream ASAP. We have to culture everyone in this room so just because they don't want to culture. Right <laughs> we <so> must sorry. <laughs> No, it's too late. You're gonna see this game played to the end. You gotta clear your date. We're gonna play the entire game on stream. You yeah. gotta watch it. You got. You got. You got to see it. I'm sorry. I'm okay, with well, him on that. Yeah, you're yeah, you're yeah, missing. Yeah. Portal. Okay. Portal you know how some things. Oh, look, 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 look. You know how some things in school are required reading courses that you have to take at least once before you graduate? Mm -hmm. Well, Portal is on the list of required games before you can yes. graduate as a gamer. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I, admit, I, I, I admit I have never seen anything about Portal. Honestly, real talk is my personal opinion, but a lot of stuff made by Valve when they were in their heyday, like, honestly, I strongly suggest that you should experience Half-Life. Half-Life 2, Portal, Left 4 Dead. Those are like really important games in my opinion. I'm not even like a big fan, but I just, I do consider them like good so stepping stones they, of gaming to experience. Yes. There is a reason why the possibility of Half-Life 3 being announced or released yes. would literally break the internet. 
It would be. It would. It, I still. I still in my soul am hyped um, about the. If it ever came out, like they, if that trailer just came out of nowhere, while my brain doesn't like, I don't like hype myself up to believe it because it's been so long. I would lose my ever loving mind if Half Life Three nice. got announced. <laughs> Go ahead. Tom, uh, yeah. Apparently, none of you have ever played Half Life Alex. Yes. Yeah, and that's why I'm so excited. I was about to say they all but said it at the end of Half Life Alex. Well, I, that's still a thing. It's it's like you know, it's one of those they things. Did directly kind of say um, it. I'll I'll be the unpopular penguin here, and I don't think those games were actually like that great. No, no they made. That's trying to. But, Portal but they, was the one that stood out above the other the others, but Half Life One and Half Life Two were mediocre at best. That's Have you did was, you play them in the time like whenever they yeah, were coming them. out? I played them at the time. Which I is just something think I've been that. Trying to... Go ahead. I only tried to get my words in edgewise five times. It's fine. So that I've been trying to say for a little while now is that yeah, with with Half Life, Half Life Two, Portal, those games, is that they are they're no longer the best games out there, but they were the best games of their time. They are they represent really big stepping stones in gameplay design, and there's a lot of gameplay design elements they have, which in and of themselves are timeless and unfortunately a lot of people overlook those in modern game development which is I why I, I feel like they are required they're, something that's required if you want to call yourself a gamer or a game dev you have to have at least a passing familiarity with them i agree those are the big things while they have aged and there's stuff that of course have done stuff better than them by far that is because they were the stepping stones to a lot of things. And a lot of things they did are still fantastic Develop, developer, like video game making techniques that a lot of devs do not do for some reason. Like simple things, like simple little things when it comes to like placing a storyline quest or having an NPC that doesn't become super stupid annoying because they actually think about that kind of stuff when they made the game about NPC talking too much or repeating lines and stuff like that. They were doing that first when it was brand new to have an npc in the first place that followed you that wasn't just like a throwaway quest line and a lot of little things like that with, with physics and puzzles with physics and uh, horror elements really good really good rob no i did not see a message from you but yeah this is my passion coming out i do can agree that as a game though i could totally see somebody playing but like this isn't that fantastic it's it's kind of hmm but I don't know. For me, even even now, I could play Half Life Two and be like, "This is pretty fucking solid. This actually has a lot of cool points." I think Half Life Alex did a really good job of capturing that again in VR and like kind of yeah. capturing well, the see, that, magic of that. Well, that. That's the thing it, when it comes to the Half Life title titles, which is part of why Half Life Three has such a gigantic yoke to bear, is that um, Half Life One did things that no game previous had ever done. Yeah. It, it, it completely revolutionized the level of interact interactability with the map. No mm -hmm. game previous had done that. The mm -hmm. dynamic AI for the, uh, for the NPCs mm -hmm. and the enemies and stuff, no game previous had done that. And then Half-Life 2 comes out, and they've got full-on physics puzzles. There were a few games that had attempted that, but none that did it so well. Mm -hmm. And they also had uh, the, the dynamic lighting for the flashlight. Mm -hmm. Games previous hadn't hadn't really played around with that because most methods back then were very resource intensive and a lot of machines couldn't handle it. They had found ways to optimize their code enough that they could get away with the flashlight. I right. still remember that saw gun. Oh man, didn't the grab Wordle do the physics puzzles first before no. Half Life. Half Life Two was the made. They made Half Life Two first, and then they made Portal. Same same devs. Yeah. Uh, well, that it, too, so Burnin. Portal, uh, Portal had a. That too, Burnin. A first-person shooter with a solid story. Yeah, it yeah. was very much unheard of at the time. And they so actually did a story in game. The, yeah. the development yeah, team for uh, Portal. <laughs> the, the most of them were uh, the same people that had worked on Half-Life Two, but the people that were at the core of the team and that were the reason why the game was being worked on in the first place. They were actually brought in because uh, Gabe Newell had saw Narbacular drop, and he was like, "That we want that, but a full game." Oh. Mm. That's kind of how Half Life Alex worked. He brought in people with, who made Boneworks and got them in to uh, work on Half Life Alex wait, for the, that engine. Wait, the Boneworks team worked on Alex. I didn't. Yeah, know. yeah, yeah, yeah. You could tell if you play Boneworks, you could tell that engine. I, I know. Very fucking I've similar. I played both. 
Yeah. Yeah, that, th those games both have some of the best VR physics yep. and most immersive VR mechanics I've ever yep. worked with. Yep, and that's why Half-Life Alex was so solid. They got them, and they got them to kind of fine-tune a little bit, and that those same devs worked on Half-Life Alex. Boneworks, yep. Seriously, anyone out there, if you've played either Boneworks or Alex, but not played the other, mm -hmm. go. go. Go play yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Boneworks is more of a, I would say, like, it feels way more like a test demo thing, because it's not like a full-on game, per se. It does, it does have that in there, but it does have that little tinge of, like, oh, this feels like that kind of VR experience you expect that like it's not a complete game it's a lot of feels like a tech demo a little bit but Half-Life Alex though feels like a full ass game plus um, when you're done playing it tons of mods tons of mods so but yeah um Boneworks started out as a tech demo and they still actually use it as a uh, testing platform for a lot of their stuff oh interesting okay. yeah got a little passionate there sorry that's, that's one of those things that like I feel like none of people know about and it's like hold up he's ticking up by the second but you can't get back the way you came. The instability makes all routes one way. And that's where my Octavice comes into play. It'll get you back to the garage, but it needs to be charged first. Uh, but don't you worry your pretty little head about how it works. You'll be out of here soon, so there's no reason to learn more about limb technology than you need to know. I'm not even angry. I'm being so Use the Octavice map. Oh. You'll use it to open a gateway back to the garage. But it will immediately collapse the stability around you. So only activate when you're absolutely ready to leave. You do not want to get caught in the storm that follows. You're ready to leave? Good luck, have fun, don't die. Okay. Well, you guys, well, you guys have some big news. Oh, the arc device is the thing you pulled out earlier. Oh. Oh, the orb? You don't need more than one. Wait, can you, wait, uh, you, it's next. Uh, uh, right on, can you, can you hold on to more than one at a time? Yeah, you see that little bar right by it? Bar. Yeah. Uh, I think that yellow bar means how much of a charge you've got. I'm not certain, though. Oh, so oh, the more you have, the bigger the charge. Oh. I need... Okay, let's play this. Look, I, I keep thinking the way you're helping our friend here right now seems positively helpful. I seems like me. You're looking to turn a new leaf or something? The only thing I want to look at is a 12-year-old whiskey and the back of this breach's mm -hmm. head when I send them packing. But isn't it worth taking a detour to run just a tiny little test? Can't think of a worse way to spend my time. Please. Yep. I've seen you manipulate waveforms with your right hand and knock back a double with your left. Or am I to understand you've <laughs> lost your touch? What I'm understanding is that you won't shut the hell up until I test this remnant. <laughs> yep. Damn. Fine. Stop crowding my frequency. What? Wait. Really? Arpy, darling, you never give in this easily. What's What's going on? Francis? Uh, y yes? How have you not thrown him to the bunnies by now? <laughs> the bunnies? <laughs> 80 years the old, he's getting sharper by the day. You're a legend. You're a role model. I'm giving you 10 <laughs> seconds to get out of my... Okay, okay, uh, we're signing off. Hey, driver, good luck out there. And mm. uh, watch out for the bunnies. They are a doozy. Huh. Yes, we are. <laughs> Marty Python reference. <laughs> uh, hey, Rick, were you, uh, hey, Rick were, you my, were you calling my name earlier? No, I thought you were saying something, you got drowned out. Oh, yeah, I was just saying that if that you guys got kind of got me, you guys ever streamed uh, those games, the the Portal or the Half Life things, I'd love to. Yeah. <laughs> so I've done Portal multiple times. I've never actually played Half Life 1, but I did play Half Life 2. Nice. Um, um, so here's the thing Half Life mm -hmm. 1 because of just how old the game is it yeah. doesn't 100% stand up to the test of time no nah. however black mesa yes is such a faithful recreation mm -hmm. if you play through black mesa you have all of the plot you need it's all still intact all mm -hmm. of the uh, major landmarks are all still there all the major routes everything 
there are a few th the few things that they tweaked were tweaked for the better or to incorporate things that the devs originally wanted to do but didn't have the chance to because of the bad tech at the time yeah seriously Jeez. if you're going to, if you want to pl uh, play half-life one just play black mesa noted a multiplayer oh, my game. avatar is talking. Oh, right, because of the way I have it set up for stuff. Oops. Well, yeah, I, 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 yeah, I, I, I did, I did notice that when the the radio the radio people were talking, Pay was also moving his mouse. I kind of like mouse. that though. I'm not gonna lie. I think it's funny. Yeah, yeah I think so too. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's 3 a.m. in the morning for me. I think I should head to bed. But it was nice hanging out with you guys. Good night. I'm probably going to be done with this here Good night. I can't sleep. I've drunk the energy drink and I'm feeling the energy flow through me like the power of a thousand suns. Anywho, you want to talk about Half-Life 3? What were you going to say, Tanya? I should head to bed too. Oh, okay. No, but I want to talk about Half-Life with you more. I've got another... 45 minutes before I absolutely positively 100% need to go to bed. <laughs> Yay! Of course. Yeah, I, I love how I love how everything's connected too, by the way. Like, Portal and Half-Life have the same, like, world they're in. So, like, Aperture Science is part of Half-Life's lore. Like, it's kind of, like, the reason why they... I think, I think uh, if I remember, Aperture Science was, like, a rival to the main, like, science company from Half-Life. And uh, they're the reason why a lot of the tech got made. Like the portal was like the reason I believe there's like a, there's a portal tech for Half Life's company, if I can recall right. It's pretty cool. I really want to see the story finish. It did finish, but we never got back to it. Oh, Rob, what's up? How's it going? Hi, Rob. Hear you talking Half Life lore? Yes, let's go. High five. Oh, God, it's a All right. <laughs> so like, yeah, yeah, it's pretty pretty neat. I'm looking forward to seeing what they actually. Uh, I don't want to talk about Half Life Alex stuff because just in case somebody hasn't played it since it's like the last one of the series. I have. But the whole. Yeah, yeah. But, but so let's not talk about Half Life Alex. But Portal and Half Life being connected is sick. I don't think Left 4 Dead's any kind of connection at all. Thankfully, it's like the yeah, zombie man. multiverse. But but Portal and Half Life for sure have a connection. I'm trying to think of yeah, any other connections. Yeah, I mean, I said I was heading to it, but now I feel like sticking around just to see what you guys talk about. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, who is it that just joined in? Rob. 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 Uh, look, Gordon. Science. We Please remember the Arcanium, Rob. Stop fucking with the we microwave. The terminus. What about the microwave? Ah, by the way, Rob, what do, what do you think of my new talkie icon? New talkie icon? Oh, no. Oops. 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 No rat. Yes. No rat. I was close with mouse rat rodent. <laughs> everybody always says everybody always says mouse first, but yeah, I'm a rat. It's a I said I said mouse, and I was like, no, the, the, the ears are too small. <laughs> Honestly, it, it's kind of funny. Rat Raharu, all the R's, so it's like he. <laughs> My brain doesn't let call you rat first because I feel okay. Don't take this the wrong way. I only feel it's insulting because of Great Mouse Detective. It's uh, it's made my brain think that saying rat, rat is bad. No, rat again. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> Man, the dude died for saying rat. So I'm like, oh shit. I'm gonna send to the cat. <laughs> no, that no, worries. Rat. <laughs> no worries at all. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. It's all right. It'd be nice to do like a, I guess a Disney Renaissance community night or movie community night. I mean, I don't, I don't mind a Disney month when we watch a Disney movie every night. That'd be sick. One day. Well, that would be cool. I would definitely watch Great Mouse Detective again. Robin oh, Hood would be a good what? one. Robin Hood. I haven't watched that in so long. Lion King. Which the, the, the animated one, right, Rex? The animated one. I personally rather like. I yes. Personally rather, I personally rather like the Jungle Book. Oh yes, Jungle, Jungle Book is yes. definitely a vibe. I want to see Kai that was, again? That, that was that was like my childhood movie. Which one? Oh, yeah. Hey. Jungle Book. Don Bluth too. Don Bluth. All dogs go to heaven. Stuff like that. Plus a lot of those. I thought all dogs go to heaven wasn't a Disney movie. Dumb. No, no, it's Don Bluth. I, I said sorry, it's do nothing. Oh, that. 
have on the Penguin too and stuff. They're probably not all that great, but I know like some of them are really good. Like uh, uh Secret of the Nymph, right? Ooh, yeah, Secret, really Secret, Secret of Nymph. Right. However, you should like that one. one. Huh? Right. Um, what about me, Rick? Secret of the Nymph. You know about that one, right? I know about that one, yeah. Okay. The thing Secret of Nymph? Oh shit, good luck, sir. Oh, uh, Paint, don't get zapped. Though, so. I wish this was co-op. This feels like this should be a co-op game at some point. I rather what, agree. Yeah, it does look like it could be co-op. Oh, the pouch, something is wrong. It's, it's co-op, it's you and the GPS. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. No, oh, no, oh no, god! No, no. Better. What? One oh, wait, player I'm, I'm is the person, the, the other thing. player is the Taurus. Guy. I thought you said you didn't worry about Ooh. them. What kind of oh, reaction was that? Seems like they spooked you. Oh, there's oh, a whole bunch of them. Oh, oh. No, I, thought, I thought they weren't that big of a deal, oh, sir. That's a, that's a lot I, th of them. I, th I thought I you didn't care about Taurus I, anymore. Wait, are, are, they, the... are they like weeping angels? Because it's kind of that movie you're looking at them. Oh, yeah. no. Yes. So wasn't the... there a game? There was a game, I think, before the weeping angels, which literally revolved sir. around oh. mannequins. Sir, you're going to crash your car. Sir, sir, you don't have to do this, sir. Just let them be in the forest, sir. Sir, you don't have. To, you're gonna damage your. Remember what Rygon said? Your car has a limit. Oh God, you ran into a tree. Oh my, sir, look at your car. No, look at the HP of your car. Oh no, you're out of the green. The front of your car is red. Ooh. That's Ooh. That was worth it. But ow. I see him. Yeah. Are you oh, still no. running them over? Oh, you're gonna. Yeah, there he goes. My god, so many fight. of them. Right, so, Any input on what's happening right now? Why do they why do they explode oh, when you run them me. over? Take your time. If you are never they, get are, back are to they, the garage, are they are they ready to That suits me just fine. Oh, oh. Oh. If anything wants to read the story. Woo! Oh! oh. Hello there, baller! Oh! No, no argument. Pump your car. Also, a game where the, also, a game where the cop is, uh, you, one is a person, one is a GPS, those are like an interesting concept. Kind of like that one game we played one time where we were, we were trying to instruct you on how to disable a bomb. Oh, yeah. keep talking oh, and nobody one. explodes. Yeah, that one. Is yeah, yeah, that one. Yeah, that one. <laughs> it's like one person buys the game and they send the um a book thing to their friends to yeah to, for them to do the talking while they actually play the game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I probably should help with that. The uh for that rent assistance fundraiser. Uh, starting now for every ten jelly bean. Bane boozled jelly bean. I still have a whole freaking case I haven't opened yet, so yay. If it happens, I do it all at once. So, eat. That's probably gonna be bad. But I think I'm feeling better from the sniffles that I could do this. Thanks. <laughs> What's up? You've made one, you've made me want to reinstall the Half Life games again. Yay! Good. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Go experience Ooh. some nice things. I still need to drag you into war against the cyborgs, so... Oh, you the cyborgs? What? The cyborgs, you say? Oh, <laughs> yeah? I love yeah. the I love the I, I love the way you splash paint on the vehicle and 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 it, and it freak and the paint just just <laughs> hey, look, into it's, it. It's paint painting. He's, he's, the the paint is like the paint is like healing a healing salt for, for the car. He, he's he's just... he's just making a sa sa sacrifice for the Said machine goo? spirit. The machine spirit? Yeah. Uh, my head canning is that that paint is full of, you know, paint drool, and he's just slathering on the on the car and it fixes it. Because you know, paint licks. Yeah, I'm healing, and, healing licks. Yeah. Healing licks. Healing licks, except I don't think paint would want to lick the actual car, so it's just all in a bucket. <laughs> would that actually work, paint? Like, would your drool actually fix a car like this? It's that I good. I doubt it. 
Healing, oh. new, 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 new he, he, healing item, paint, paint bucket. Nice. It's the paint bucket. <laughs> it's his paint drill. Just, it cleans your car this good. <laughs> it looks like drool. Just say it. Me. Man, I wish it's just it works like this in real life. I know, right? Exactly. Indeed. That'd be nice. It's anomalous uh, repair putty. Anomalous repair putty, he says. <laughs> sure, paint, sure. <laughs> there you go, Raru, healing licks. <laughs> it's even green. Okay. <laughs> Okay, sadly I'm reaching my limit now. I'm heading to bed now. Good night, guys. Have a good night. night. Good night. Thank you, thank you. Mark it. Mark it. I dare you. No, don't do it. Do it. Don't What's do it gonna it. do? It's just a rock. Actually, they don't seem to be uh, dangerous. Anything. It's just a. Uh... Because it blocks the way and it might damage if you drive into it. Yeah. Well, we took care of all the tourists, so. Woo! Yay! Now time to cause problems. By the way, that's just me. Every time you see one of those codes come up, that's me doing that as uh, Earth Rex. Those anchors may look like glowing I'm trying to help. Magic, but it's look! There you go. Through. Don't be scared. They haven't exploded in anyone's face. <laughs> Are the pillars helping? I'm trying to like cover you. You have cover now. Oh, that's a lot of charge. Yeah. Next destination, blue thing. Oh, um, I. Oh. I have transitioned over to my computer, so if I sound quiet, that's why. Oh, good. Oh, well, another thing that reminds now. me of. Uh -huh. what, what are your pr pr pronouns? You said you tra transitioned to co computer. Oh, you're a protege now. Good Stop. job for transitioning. <laughs> Tanya, <Congrats. Stop. laughs> I'm proud of you. So, uh, another oh, thing that Half-Life 2 did, that was the get first, they were the first to, one of the first to have vehicles in their game for a first person uh, shooter, if I recall right. That I remember oh. doing. Uh, Half Life 2, they were like, they had vehicles for the first time in like uh -huh. an open world kind of way. They did a lot of firsts. It was kind of interesting. A lot of companies did a first way back then. And now people are, <laughs> and nowadays it's just like, oh hey, there's this idea. It's not new, but we can reinvent the wheel, I guess. But you're not really reinventing anything. I really yeah. want a flashlight. Yeah, it, 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 it does, does, does go a bit beyond the whole... It, it's stuff that's been d done be before, though. In a lot of cases, it's just... Well, de developing something new t takes time, and there's a ch mm -hmm. chance people won't like it, so let's just use the thing everybody kn knows already. Yeah. Yeah. Their engine was pretty dang nice. There was like they were they they were like that company that worked off their own engine. So basically, consider them like the Crisis engine. You see that one game that was like made using the Crisis engine that was pretty okay. Kind of showed off like a tech demo. With them, they had a tech demo with Half Life Two, but it actually was a pretty dang nice full fledged game. I can't think of any other companies that do that now. I like the the construction mech things in the in Half-Life in Black Mesa. Oh. Ones that you, you you see them briefly when you're entering in the train and then you see like a couple of them not functioning. Mm -hmm. I also quite like the fact that they come with a fucking they're meant to be piloted. There's a chair with a whole like, control panel on them. That's mm. just not occupied or used in any way, shape or form. I know one thing they did so great is the way they did bugs. You played Half-Life 2, right? You said, uh, yes. Master? Yes. Hey, so you remember how they did the bugs in that game? Yes. And 
I remember it being so cool because they built it up so they knew how to do a build up. They knew how to like like in game make a build up happen. So they kind of showed you having that guy just get murdered in front of you. And then you had that scene with all the dirt where you couldn't step on the dirt and you just get instantly attack and just destroyed. And then it just it was just really good. It had a build up and it had it, they did so many things with those bugs that made it so cool. Stuff I don't even want to say because it's spoilers and it would like kind of ruin the magic of it, but they really knew how to like use whatever set pieces they made and also build on it and give you like payoff through all of it. So I just I just have like good memories of that game. It may have been it may still be dated as hell, but the way they did set pieces build up payoff with like stuff like enemies, like those bug enemies, pretty damn cool. I still have good memories of that. Episode one and episode two were also great. Yes, in their own right. It did suck they never finished it like they did, but they, they did they like planned, expand. They planned up to episode four, didn't they? Yeah, they were trying to do a they whole series with out. it. Nah, you could tell they were, oh man. That probably, when it comes to video games, that scene in episode two still lived with me for a long time as one of the most emotional scenes. Oh, hey, scenes Game Boy. Me. A Game Boy! A Game Boy? A Game Boy. I miss those things. I, I play, oh, that's a, like a It's moment. a proper one that's solid too. Yeah. With, yeah with the Game Boy Color you could see through to all the circuits and it was the coolest thing. Oh, the clear ones with the clear cases as somebody yeah. who... Yeah, that's cool. Everybody mess with the Game Boy camera a lot? Because I used to mess with those so damn much. I thought they were the coolest things ever. This, this is before everybody had a camera and a, and a whole computer in their pocket. The Game yeah. Boy camera was like, oh yeah, this is a cam- Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this is like a camera in my, in my, on my portable console and you could play a little mini game. Okay, you can play mini games and stuff in it. You take pictures and put your face on like a character and like play with so them. Adorable. So cool. What? What? Danger. But yeah, it's really dope. You should definitely. I don't know. I don't know how you can re-experience. I don't know how you can re-experience a Game Boy again. But th that's one of those things like you don't really get to experience like the Game Boy Color, the Game Gear, stuff like that as much anymore unless you retro hunt. But it's really dope. Those those are some, some interesting pioneering games. Uh, Valerie is talking to you, Rex. By the way. What? Half Life One had vehicles. It, oh God! Hey, do you like those my moves? are big ballards? Yeah, I'm working. I'm leveling up. How you like them? Is it helping? Uh, like no. Oh, <laughs> change me back. I'm sorry. I can't help it. It's the only thing I can do is make big rocks appear at the moment. This place is weird. I'm like Godzilla? I kind of look like- Yeah, I like that, thank yeah, you. Kind of, you kind of look like the, 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 the 2000s. Yes, it looks like hot there, death, yeah. but it's wait, wait, so wait, 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 wait. Scrambled by the instability. Guys, <laughs> story. It's okay. Just, just have the, uh, have the video up on the Discord so you don't you catch it when it pops up. It has audio that pops up sometimes at the top. Uh, Rex, the guy you're talking about was named Laszlo in Half-Life 2. Laszlo, you talking about the cop friend? Are you talking no. about the uh, which one? Um, are you talking about that one guy who was in the uh, the spooky? Laszlo is the greatest mind of this generation. Yes. Oh, Laszlo. Hi, Taurus. Bye, Bye Taurus. Wait, where are you going? Are you supposed to go in there? Is that a good thing? I'm driving into this beam of death. <laughs> yes, sir. No. I hope that's a good thing. Oh, you just died. Oh no. Um. Um. Okay, okay. Oh, hey, oh, yeah, you're back at the. Wow, it teleported you right back here? That's nice. Yeah. Oh, wow. You're alive. We're certain hmm? if the zone didn't get you, that gateway would. Hmm. Hmm. Damn. Did you I had so not much faith in that you? you're the first human I've sent through that thing? I mean, they've been rodents, <laughs> but it's not like it's completely untested. But anyway, it worked. Damn. So, you should you have made it back with everything you collected out there. That's the beauty of the gateway. It's the only way to get back with all your marbles intact. Now, take those huh. parts you found into the back room. I'll let you use my fabrication station. For now. That station will concoct ways for you to rig up anything from roof racks to flare guns. Assembling an antenna with those parts you brought back should be easy as pie. But it requires anchor juice to work its magic, so bring back as many as you can. And just because I haven't used that garage in decades doesn't mean you can trash the place. Mess up my equipment <laughs> and I'll throw you to the anomaly so quick you'll get whiplash. We clear? 
I love this. They they really wrote her good. She's like a Sunadre or something. She's 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 kind of oh. like a jerk, but she she's, she's kind of warming up to you. I don't know. I like her. <laughs> I'm loving this so much. It's a it's a good dynamic. I think they they got some good writing, and the game's really fun. This is a damn. This is a good one. All right. Well, I think this is where we're gonna call it for this evening. <laughs> We've got Stream Raiders. Let's go run that. Oh, oh I'm one. loving this game and definitely want to do more of it. Yeah, this is oh. last battle. Last low, the guy got eaten by the bugs. Got you. Tried so many times to save that guy. He's, he's, he's the only one, right? <laughs> script, scripted to d d die. Yeah, I tried to save him too. Damn, don't mur we murdered those guys. Good job, team. I I I, I actually actually used we we weapon spawning and uh, cheats to slow the g g game sim down. Mm -hmm. Um, if you kill kill um, kill the uh, ant, ant lion, he still dies. Nope. Oh. All right. Well, thank you everybody for joining us today for Pacific Drive. I will definitely be enjoying doing this game again. But mm. check out our website, zgfgaming.com. We've got links for our Discord, Telegram, Mastodon, Blue Sky, Patreon, and more. There on the website, as well as down in the description below through our link tree. Thank you to my patrons, tippers, and subscribers. It is your support that keeps this channel alive and going. I could not do this without your guys' help and support, whether your support is, you know, financial or just with your time. Consider becoming a patron over at patreon.com slash zgfgaming. Uh, you can support the channel there as well as by using our Humble Bundle partner link or by using our Fantasy Grounds affiliate link. Uh, those links are available through our link tree. Thank you so much for joining though, and I bid you all the most fondest a duke. Thank you. Go watch, go watch the next video. You'll love it. Radical. It's right there. It's probably going to come out soon. It's the thing. We're playing more Pacific Drive. Just go check out it. Go check out it. <laughs>